Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Um, oh, we haven't we? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Quite nice. I don't know what you're saying nice about, but there you go. <laughs> also, it's nice on the videos. <laughs> uh, vintage Rebellion. Hi, guys. Have you ever collected any vintage bootleg figures? The Polish That's ones. We'll, 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 wait on that. we'll wait on that question till uh, John yeah. decides yeah. to drag himself in. <laughs> They're cool. they quite cool, the Polish ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll we'll answer that once we've gone through what we've picked up today. If, if we've picked anything up, yeah. Um, yeah. And if when John comes in, he can jump on that question as well. Um, yeah. We have got. We have. We have got a subject for tonight. <laughs> Finally, got a subject oh. for tonight. Yeah. Uh, did you read that article well, I sent over? Yeah, 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 yeah. Good. Good. Yeah, <laughs> I, I've. I've because yeah that's yeah but diamond yeah. yeah yeah we're just going to be talking about um what I don't know if I, I don't know if I want to mention the the website really I'm going to have to because I'm going to have to show it bleeding full um about diamond diamond yeah, not, use your mics mentioned it as well today hasn't yeah it? there's a few people I've, I noticed uh, yeah. Dumcock, even Dumcock mentioned it and things like that yeah oh, John's just coming in so. <laughs> We've yeah. got one as well. Yeah. So that's good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We'll just, we'll just start, John. So, um, yeah. We'll just, yeah, we're, just gonna, right we're gonna go through what, what, what we've got today, but I just, uh, I just want to point any, any of the viewers in if, if you want to go read that before, um, oh, while well, you're listening to us, that's, um, what we're going to be talking about tonight over on. I don't, yeah, we got. Well, I'll have to mention them anyway yeah. because because um, we're going to be using them. Yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah. So that's, that's what we're going the to wrong. Pic that's the wrong picture. They've got those figures there. That's I don't know who put oh, that picture yeah. in. Oh yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. That's nothing to do with what they sell. Yeah. So no, no. They've no. Um, all the Phantom Menace have picked it up and run with it. Yeah, they so would. Yeah, we're here to debunk yeah. all that basically. Yeah. Can't they? Oh, it's like, oh, can't wait, can't wait to rant. Oh, I can't oh, rub it yeah. in Yeah, oh, I can't wait to make more misery. Yeah, I've unfollowed Nerd Erotic and I've stopped watching his videos and things like that. So, yeah, stop. <laughs> I, mean, that, yeah. I, I mean, I I don't follow Dumcock, but it, it came up about it obviously because it must have flashed up because it was toy related. Yeah. So, yeah, I don't, watch, don't watch any of them. No, used to watch them. No, uh, no. critical drinker. I don't watch. Yeah. So it's probably the only one because he's quite funny. Yeah. Uh, he's he's tongue-in-cheek, tongue really. So, um, yeah. Matt, have you got anything today? Have you um, <laughs> I've got one tiny little thing. I've got a gun. <laughs> <laughs> a he a gun. A He-Man figure, right? which is oh, coming. Cool. But oh, no, oh, that done, is all my stuff, I'm going to have a mass delivery, like, I think, soon, or by the end of the week or next week. Yeah, I think everybody's yeah, the same. Everybody's everybody's the same. Yeah. 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 What What gun does that go to? Who does that go to? That's for the, um, oh, no, Optic. Optic with a, oh, with a K. Oh, yeah, K. yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, the He-Man figure, mean, yeah. Yeah, yeah I bought a figure. Yeah. And he was in really good nick, but he didn't have the gun. And I just picked this up for about, I think it was about seven quid. So um, cool. it's not bad. So ten you know, for the um, figure. And that. Speaking so, of uh, things, so so get, I, oh, I, I bought a, I bought a couple bits. And Mark, you might want to, or Matt, you might want to check this out. Well, both you guys, because you you're both kind of looking for bits. But um, there's a place called Go Figure on uh ebay it's a store and yeah. it was quite it was quite interesting because i found two or three guns that i needed and he had them priced like 3.99 4.99 2.99 stuff like that and i was like that's the cheapest i've seen for some of these okay. guns and then there's there's like that. there's star wars palatoy there's gi joe action force um transformers uh robotech stuff like all kinds of things on there he man and uh i was so i was going through looking at what they had because some of those prices were cheaper than i've ever seen 
And um, I ended up ordering like five or six things off them because they even had like they had like Bazooka's helmet for ninety nine cents, you know. Wow. And uh, wow. I need a helmet. I need a helmet for my bazooka. So I, I started going through it, and then when I went into the, it said it said on one of the descriptions, make sure you add everything to the cart because the cart is set up at our store to do discounts after a certain quantity or whatever. So right. I got an email while I was looking and she said, you get 50% off one item. So pick an item. And as she said, just check the little box in the shopping cart, which I did. And it just immediately turned it to 50% off. So I, I went back and unchecked that box and I went and found like a $10 item they had like, and put it in there yeah. and checked the box and it went $5. But then, I, like I said, I, I had like 10 or so items, and it said, if you buy like a dollar thirty eight more worth of stuff, I don't know how they set their eBay cart to do this, but it said, if you purchase another dollar thirty eight, you'll get 25% off your entire order. Nice. So I found like one, I found one more item that was like a two dollar item, threw it on there, and then it ended up cutting it down. So I got like 20, 19, I got 19 parts coming and they ended up averaging out to about two dollars a part wow so i was like and the shipping she said there's only one shipping charge three bucks unlimited parts yeah. you know yeah so i'll look it up go figure it was called go figure and uh yeah, you gotta search, yeah. the, search the stores for go figure and uh, yeah. i don't know what her prices are to send overseas though you know what i mean it's gonna of course yeah 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 here well, in the probably, state. What you, probably what you told us today the price <laughs> <laughs> yeah that was i that couldn't believe it i was like are you kidding me because I, I had i had a package i had a box that was going to france a box to, a box to germany a box to netherlands a box to canada and mark's yeah. box to the uk and they yeah. were the, the canada and the nether the netherlands one i screwed up because the way he wrote the address is like opposite and yeah, so it's weird yeah, yeah, so I didn't have what I thought was like the street address was really the zip code, the the, the, the postal code. code. Yeah, yeah, so I had to like redo the form. So I took it home and I'll go back tomorrow and do it. And yeah, then um, Germany as well, isn't it? I think they use this big zip yeah, code or something. Yeah, but somehow I got the Germany one right. I don't know. I just <laughs> maybe the way it was. I think it was just because the order they wrote it and when they sent me the sent yeah. it to this address, you know. So. Yeah, because I mean, uh, the, the, those two parcels go past UK. They must stop at UK and then go on. Maybe I don't know. They would. I don't but know. You they, they might have, so that's crazy, isn't it? So uh, it was like France was like twelve dollars, Germany was ten or something like that, or maybe it was yeah. Germany was ten, France was twelve, and then UK yeah. was twenty four. And I'm like, yeah, and the UK one I think weighed the least. I was like, yeah, screw what you. The hell? Much, yeah, <laughs> typical UK, isn't it? Trying to get and yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. all I was saying. The guy, cool. the guy at the post laughed because I had written, I written in black marker on the box. This is a gift. <laughs> the guy at the post <laughs> laughed. He goes, "Oh, did you get, you get that? Did you get hit with that before?" And I was like, "Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah." yeah. It is. This is bad, isn't it? Bad. So. We haven't picked anything up then. We've just been sending today, have we, John? Well, Roboto's supposed to be in the mail. It says del it says out for delivery, so... It could be there in a minute. I got, no post. I, got, I got no post again today. Which, but, I mean, um, I went from a greedo, but I don't know if you can see that down there that I got today. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I watched that video and you unboxed it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah I've got a clean. I watched... I got to watch Matt's videos on the G.I. Joe and then the Marvel one today. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah give, it, give it a bit of a clean. I've ordered the ladder from for the back. Yeah. Yep. Three, four pound. You got All those to, parts you got... should only be five or less. They're not that oh, – yeah. it should it, be easy to get those parts. Yeah. And on tonight, yeah. um, there's a part yeah. that's in America and he hasn't got shipping for it, so I need to ask him how much shipping would be for it. Is there, a, is, there a, is, there, one. is there a particular figure that goes with that playset? I'm sure there is, isn't there? No, yeah. no. In the United States, there was not, but I don't know about yeah, actual. There wasn't. 
Maybe well, there I'm, wasn't. I'm just going to no. shove the ones I've got in there for now. <laughs> no, no, maybe there wasn't. Uh, you the can get yourself. The instructions are twelve pound. Yeah, yeah. You get yourself a nice little helicopter to put on top of it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'll, I'll get. I'll get something yeah. like that. Yeah, blow thunder. Yeah. Well, I always put the um. What was that? The sky? Is it the Skyhawk? The 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 green one with the that could vertical take off and it had the flat wings on the back oh, on the yeah. side. Yeah, yeah. I could put my mask on it. There you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's supposed to be it's the same universe, isn't it? It's supposed to be. Yeah. Now, now, now. I mean, back now, in the day, it was it was, it was, it was now Kenner from... versus. <laughs> Because back in the day it was Kenner versus Hasbro, so it wasn't. Yeah. Now Hasbro owns Kenner, so now they are. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Well, when I was when I was a kid, all my figures all went into one black hole, Battlestar Star Galactica. Star oh yeah, they all went. <laughs> I played them all together, but all like all three three quarters, so they all fitted in. Especially yeah. uh, Battle Star Galactica with those alien figures. <laughs> Have you uh, have you changed position there, John? You look like you've moved again. So uh, yeah, he's moved. He's moved around. I think he moved yeah, around. I was trying to. Good night. I'm trying to find out which corner. Whoa, am I still there? I'm trying to find out which corner has less of a glare. All right. Because there's yeah. all there's like the cabinets have lights. Like this one has. The, it's like opposite day. That light. Yeah. And there's always a glare on stuff, so I'm trying to like. Yeah, I've got. Where can I go in the room that's not? I've got to get a hundred watt bulb, so it makes it brighter in here. So yeah. that's my. I keep saying I get one, so I keep forgetting. I asked the I asked the wife to get one when we went food shop. Once she went food shop in, and she said it's too technical. It's a bulb. <laughs> <laughs> there's too many. It's a bayonet. It's hundred watt. <laughs> Run away. <laughs> Too much. That's too much. Okay. Okay. I'll have to find it. <laughs> right, a, bit, a bit of news. A bit of news now. A bit of, bit of news. Yeah, a bit of news. Uh, Hasbro have, brought, have released another advert. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, it's got seatbelts. Yeah. They didn't help. <laughs> <laughs> look at Dak. They didn't look like that when we left him. <laughs> he looks like, he looks like he could take on the entire empire by himself. Yeah, he tried to. <laughs> didn't last yeah, very long. <laughs> Yeah, just need a large attack leg now, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> one leg. Yeah. People will probably be making one, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. People are will be. Definitely. Photographer yeah. people. But, yeah. They will yeah. be loving that. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, those um, <laughs> those looks have gone on pre-order. Well, they've gone on, on live now. Are they the shipping now those Luke Skywalker figures to go in it? What, the, uh, the next... Yeah, yeah, it, it came out last night this, this morning. Uh, Star Action figures have got the second wave of the 40th anniversary coming this week, hopefully, except for Lando. But the whole wave's coming in, and the Pro Bots coming this week. So yeah. I've pre ordered the I pre ordered the Snow Speeder, Luke, and the Rebel and the Hoff Rebel Trooper. That's the only two I want out of the wave because I've got the other ones really. And the, you know, well, I've got Lando before when they released it, and um. I don't want another TIE fighter. Um, R2 is tempting, but I'm just leaving that one for now. So um, there's just too many things coming out. I wanted the probe droid, which is uh, um, so hopefully that will come next week. So uh, we never know. But, yeah, and the helmet's definitely supposed to be coming early. So I think you were saying. Oh, God. So I think it's Star Action Figures and In Demand Toys have both got a load of stock. They must be getting the same stock from like Hasbro Direct or wherever they are or in the uk so yeah 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 i sure hope they get to my house because i mean that's remember that stuff i was telling you guys about day like weeks ago that was yeah. in the mail it still yeah. hasn't shown up i have yeah. seven 
there's seven items from Hasbro Pulse, one from GameStop and one from Amazon that still yeah. have not started. Amazon. And they, yeah. they, they still show it as in transit. I check the tracking and it's like, it's in transit. It's on its way, yeah. you know, but I'm like, this is the longest they've ever taken to get to my place. And some, some, uh, some other news today, Marvel news. Uh, uh, Hasbro have decided to re-release the Toy Toys R Us exclusive Groot that came out with uh, right. the Baby Groot and the Plant Groot. And now it goes for around 50, 60 pound dollars. Um, and they've decided today they're going to re-release it. So uh, we will be seeing that sometime end of the year, hopefully, because mm -hmm. I need one <laughs> to finish my uh, Guardians of the Galaxy set. So, yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. I got, I got the Build-A-Figure one. I got the Build-A-Figure one. That's what it. That's what it was. They put it together, and then Toys R Us released it. But they ah. they didn't put they didn't put the legs on the bottom of it. The legs were separate in the bottom of the box. But he so he could take up most of the box. He looks weird in the box. Then you've got the baby yeah. Groot and the plant Groot next to him, and that's yeah. That's okay. what they're just going to re-release it. So uh, so stop all those scalpers out there charging fifty sixty quid for it. So wow. Yeah. 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 So that's good news. I'll definitely get one. Yeah, he's, he's the tallest. Right. He's the tallest six-inch scale figure that I have, and it's a. It's like it was funny because I, I made all the shelves to sort of make sure they fit Chewbacca, and then when yeah. I was putting Groot, I was putting Groot out there, and he's taller than Chewbacca, so now he's kind of bent over a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Groot has to. Groot has to hunch down a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's funny you should mention uh, postage because that that platform came through Hermes. Yeah, and it's coming in a few. Uh, you don't want to trust me. So you yeah, don't want, no. it's actually coming one piece on time. Yeah. Early. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, track proper tracking for it. Yeah. <laughs> did I just oh, did it? Uh, were you just watching outside the door? Then we yeah, well, he just looked. Oh yeah. There, or, he actually got a, I actually got an email this morning saying it'll take it'll be between two and four. So I knew oh, when right. it was probably, uh, like ten to ten to two. Yeah. So it was early. Anyway, uh, I've got another yeah. one coming from Hermes, so I'm not going to uh, praise them just yet. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I've had no post proper post. It's just that Hermes. Yeah, yeah, I've had no. That's yeah. Um, usual Mike put a video up. I don't know if you've seen it. Of his yeah, shopping. Going, yeah, poor Blake. <laughs> Somebody told him there was some 40th anniversary, didn't they? In, in the, is it Kmart? Yeah, Kmart, yeah. the shop they got over there. Yeah. It did. This yeah. seems all too familiar to me. Yeah. I mean, the thing is, they've actually got some Black Series on the on the pegs. Yeah. Which we yeah. Array. <laughs> Great array. Yeah. Yeah, right. Yeah. 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 But, but, That's what always amazes me. It's like full, 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 full. And then you get to Star Wars empty. Yeah. Like yeah. that whole aisle was full of figures, see? And then yeah. you get to Star Wars and it's basically empty. Yeah. That must mean some, that, that, that says something that people are buying them, but they're not replacing them, aren't they? So, but there's always loads of... Always loads of Transformers. <laughs> yeah. 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 Have you seen yeah. his, um, did you see his Funko? Yes. Child yes. Funko. I wonder where he got that from. <laughs> yeah, it's handy, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He did get a Bespin Luke, though, didn't he? He got one given to him, didn't he? Yeah. Sent to him. Yeah. The, at the, the end. So he was a bit the, shocked, wasn't it? There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing in it, look. Yeah. Oh, he's already got it. Wow. Well, yeah, I took it out of the box. Mine's on pre order. Well, those boxes yeah. aren't taped. Those boxes are not taped. And oh, you and can I... take them out, put them back in, oh, and you'll no, never know. All oh, right. Okay. All right. I've got a question. Why does, why does the Star Wars one's heads bubble and all the rest don't? And they have a base, don't they, as well, for some reason, don't they? Is it something to do with Star Wars ones that well, have a base on them? Not always. They they in the back in the when they first started they didn't have bases and everything had a bobblehead. 
but because that was the, what they were known for. Funko was known for making bobbleheads, but originally they yeah. were tall. They were thin bodies with a bubbly head, and they were tall. But then yeah. they shortened the bodies, and then they they've recently they've been doing some of them with no bobbleheads, just been to regular head. But well, yeah, I think all the, the Star Wars ones, ones, the Star Wars ones have bobble. bobbleheads because yeah, they, they're not action figures. They cannot yeah. create action figures. It's only Hasbro that can create action figures. Ah, they have okay. to have the on them on Star Wars. So yeah. they're not action figures. They? All, yeah. the, all, all the Funkos yeah. Yeah. don't bubble like that. Yeah. Well, some of the Marvel, not. dude. I've got, I've got Marvel. I think, it, I think it's some, Marvel as well. I think it's Star Wars and Marvel. Some, well, some don't. Yeah. I've got Marvel that don't bubble and some Marvel that do. But it depends. It's if, just, I suppose yeah. if it's like Fantastic Four and... Um, Spider Man, because yeah. it's owned by Sony, that they might have rights for that. I think, it's, yeah. it's complicated. I think that's why the base is on a lot of the Star Wars ones as well. So they glue it to a base and put Star Wars on it just to say yeah. it's, it's a fun cake. But you get all the photographer people, they're trying to break them off all the time to get better pictures to do, who do Funko, I think. So, well, yeah, the, I've seen. my bases all come off, they have pegs on them. The bases that yeah. I have, the black ones, have pegs on them. So they just pop right. the figure off and put the pegs back in. And recently yeah. they've been moving to clear bases for all the fig. All the new figures have a clear base, but the Star Wars still have that black, thicker base. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 So he's. Because um... I was upset. I was upset that Star Wars came with bases, but the others did not. But yeah. like I got the um, I got the Battle Angel Alita, and she comes with a clear base. So I'm like, oh, finally they're doing bases for him again. And like the um, the the latest uh, Rick and Morty's, they have a clear base also. So I was mm. like, finally they're doing like bases for all of them. So he's, uh, he mentioned uh, Deluxe Number Four that's coming out for Black Series. Is it Zeb? No, no, no. <laughs> Come on, come on. There you go. $45. Actually, yakface.com. Deluxe Luke and Yoda. Oh, the yeah. training Luke? Is it the yeah. training yeah. Luke? Yeah. Yeah. Let's hope his arms look okay, not compared to the uh, 3.75 figure. So, uh, yeah. I think they said Hopefully, he, the he back said Hopefully, the backpack and everything comes off so it's all separate pieces. Yeah, yeah. It'll, be, it'll be like the um, Chewbacca and Trapio, I would have thought. Yeah. yeah, he said they they might. He said they redesigned Yoda, they made it smaller, so it'll go yeah. in the backpack. So it's is a different Yoda. So uh, yeah, it has to be on it, really. Yeah, to get in a backpack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hopefully, it's like with his arms up, sort of. Oh, yeah, you got different arms or something. Yeah. So I'm looking forward to that actually. Even though I'm not quite yeah. too. <laughs> I don't know when oh, they'll put a picture. Out. They'll probably put I'll a picture out on, on the Star Wars Day, won't they? They might get to see a picture of Star Wars Day. Yeah. 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 Is that the remnant? Yeah, is that the remnant? Yeah. The one, I can't the believe one it. Really I'm damaged. I, yeah. It's got I one. Can't believe it. Oh, yeah. But it was I can't believe I've seen see people buying like 10 and stuff at a time yeah it's amazing i mean you're buying them yeah I'm just yeah. gonna rip them out just to rebuild it's like wow well that's yeah. that was that's yeah, what i was saying like perfect, isn't it? like every yeah. place that i've gone to online to order figures like especially the stormtroopers they go limit two per per order you know yeah so yeah i'm like okay you know and, and i did i ordered two of the remnants when i did that order but mm. I, I saw one of my friends like back when the Rogue One Stormtrooper was coming out, which I never got a Rogue One Stormtrooper on the Not Vintage wrong. Collection card. I never saw him. And one of my friends got like eight of them in one box. He's like, well, he's opening his box and he's like, Stormtrooper, Storm. And he goes, yeah, I ordered eight of these because they were. And I'm like, well, first off, where'd you order them from? Because every place I go is sold out. And secondly, mm. every like when I go to places like Hasbro Pulse, you can only get two. So. Where were you able mm. to order eight? You know, <laughs> like, yeah. like, come on. Yeah. 
And of course, I, I messaged him and I'm like, hey, buddy, you know, I could use one of those. I never, ever got one. He's like, oh, no, I'm I'm, I'm going to – he goes, I'm keeping them. I go, well, did you open them or something? He goes, no, not yet. But someday I want to do a big display, so I want to have a whole bunch of stormtroopers. So I'm just hanging yeah. on to them all until the day I can get another room to do a big display in, and I'm going to mm -hmm. line them all up. He goes, they, they're planned on being opened someday in the future. And I'm like, uh, I just want one. Uh, Come on, dude. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's all, is it? But that leaves him with yeah. an uneven number. If I take one, he'll have seven. And eight, oh, what is he going to do? Put, nice. put three on one side of the shuttle and four on the other? No, you want to have four and four. Oh, yeah. what well, for the to patrol the cruiser, the uh, troop transport? Yeah. Well, no, like like I know what he's talking about. You want to put the shuttle Tidarium and oh, have that right. Death Star display and all the guys standing in in lines. And then yeah. Vader and Emperor yeah. are coming out, you know, and Admiral Piet is standing there, like, <laughs> we're honored by your presence, <laughs> you know. I've also got this as well. I don't know if you uh, guys play Galaxy of Heroes. But, um, well, I, I, I did until, like, maybe a year ago. I um, used to do. Uh, I lost all my data. I'd start again, and uh, I, just, I just recently started again, so... I'm trying to build myself up again. So Mandalorian's coming. Yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's a really fun, it's a fun game, but it just takes all your time. <laughs> I just sim alt battles. <laughs> Me too. Is that, but... the, is, that a, is that the phone version? Is it you play it on your phone or your yeah. app? Yeah. On your... yeah, it's yeah. an app yeah. on your phone. Yeah, yeah. 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 I don't I don't do games on phones. <laughs> I know the Star Trek one, um, that one. So, yeah, I don't, I don't game anymore. That that was the only game I was playing on my phone. But after a while, I was like, it's just every day. It's taking an hour to two hours out of my day. I just don't want to do it. Well, even even, no even even simming all the battles, you got to do like, there's the whole galactic war you got to go through, which is like twelve or thirteen battles there. Yeah. Then you've got the raids. You've got two or three raids going on at the same time, which is they always take like a half hour to do just the raids. And then you've got um, all the individual battles you've got to do for all your characters that you're building up, you know. And it's like by the time you're – even if you sim all the battles, by the time you're done, it's like two hours have gone by. <laughs> New podcast up. The Vintage oh. Rebellion? Is it up? I, don't, I looked for it on my thing on the phone. It's not. I think they've put it up on. Um, I think they've put it up on YouTube first. On, oh, YouTube. I know Generation Skywalker have done that. They've put it up on YouTube first and then. Uh, it's oh, got, yes. Uh, We're so. going to get a plug, weren't we, on there? They said, didn't they? Maybe. Oh, yeah, um, yeah. I'm gonna to listen to it after. Yeah. After and I've got, I've downloaded it on my phone, so you should, it should be on your, on your Apple podcasts. Yeah, oh, is I it? started. I think it's on Spotify as well, isn't it? Yeah. I, I started. I started my new plug bit on. Um, yeah, no, it's videos today. So. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I saw that. I'll, yeah. I'll do a different one, a different person every day. Like maybe tomorrow, I'll do Vintage Rebellion, and just do a different person every day. You know. Well, did you see yeah. mine? Did you see the beginning of mine? Yeah, yeah, I did. What yeah, I've, um, what I've done. The um, Palo Boys. I saw the Palo Boys. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I want to try. And... Well, this is what I'm, th I'm thinking. I don't know if we need to talk about it properly, but it's uh, like making as a network and try to get other people in. Yeah. And just being yeah. like a, a collective, really, and do it yeah. properly. Yeah. So I just. I just put that at the beginning. I've got actually got to, um, my guy <laughs> um, sorting as a uh, animated thing for it. So I'll send that over to you. Yeah. And yeah. there's videos as well. Yeah. That'll be good. I'll, if we can get I'll a few people on and get us all in the same network, that'll yeah. be pretty good. Maybe set up a website and do it pro do it properly. It's just something to talk about. Facebook page and stuff, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 Um, shall we go to the questions? I'm looking at Vintage Rebellion's thing on bootlegs there, you know. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah. Hi guys, have you ever, ever collected any vintage bootleg figures? The Polish ones are pretty interesting and the Articulator series are much higher production quality than you'd expect they are. I, I've done a couple of podcast episodes about the bootlegs. Um, yeah. We looked at one the other night, didn't we, from eBay? Uh, they're, they're Polish. Oh, they're Mexican, weren't they? The Mexican Yoda. Yeah. If I, yeah. If I can find it. I don't know as many up on. I've I had a look. Well, I always love a look. There's not many up on eBay, is there? Polish bootlegs. No, no, they always no. go. For, yeah. They go for a lot of money. Yeah. Don't they? They still yeah. Some got, up, didn't they? Yeah. I like the one. Is I think it's the. It's like the biker scout one, but it's got the Hoff Trooper helmet on it. I think you know the, a rebel soldier. So Hoff oh, Trooper. Yeah. yeah, and it's it's like painted grey. It looks quite good. It's like a mixture. It's got the. It's got the legs and the sort of waist body of a biker scout. And the, yeah, yeah, it's the mixture, didn't they? They sort of mixed and matched all the legs and arms. And oh yeah, <laughs> that, that's some, some some really amazing. Uh, yeah, like, really amazing. I've I never collected of, any. I've never collected no, any. I don't. Really I know a lot of people would say they're not. You know, they're bootlegs. Why would you want to pay all that money for something that's not official? We're like, but well, they are, and to some extent, just different. You know, some people like well, people had the Polish figures. That was what they had. <laughs> to, to them, yeah. it's their figure, yeah. isn't it? So. Basically, it was like communist countries who didn't have all the wooden no. show Star Wars, and obviously yeah. they didn't have the license. So they just they bought some yeah. from wherever, yeah, molded off them, and then made knockoffs. I mean, we we looked at the Uzi last night, didn't we? How expensive those are. Yeah, Imperial Gunner with that uh, picture. That's amazing. That. Um, I can't find so that. Now, so nowadays, that really only happens in China, right? I mean, they don't hold, like you're not you don't find Polish bootlegs of today's figures, right? They get the actual oh, half yeah. figures. Yeah, you you'll find them all over. Yeah, I don't think it's just China. I think it's all over. Most of these I'm finding finding the repros. To be honest with you, I'll bring them up, but because uh, I know they make I know they make generic ones, but they're not like, you know what I mean? It's not like it's like, I think in the past, like none of the Kenner or Palatoy figures went to Poland. You know what I'm saying? So they had to make bootlegs, and that was the only way they could get them. Oh, but, cheap Boba Fett there. <laughs> but like nowadays, these. These huh? ones that are like those are what go to dollar stores. So those are like cheap ripoffs. You know what I mean? Like I don't know. Funny story about these is yeah. um, I've seen those. Yeah. There was a guy on on Gumtree, and it was selling loads of them. And he Do thought, country music. "Shut up!" There was, <laughs> um, there was a guy on Gumtree selling a load of them, and he thought they were legitimate figures. So I had to explain to wow. him that they weren't. Yeah. yeah. Don't you notice the pictures don't match the figure? <laughs> oh, yeah. He's, got, he's yeah. always Padma. Yeah. But, I mean, look at the bubble. Oh, no. The bubble's got the waffle pattern. Yeah. Someone figured out how to do it. Yeah. That's a bit scary. Yeah. It's got his uh, blue lightsaber. Whatever that is. <laughs> It's like a missile out of something else, doesn't it? <laughs> so it probably is. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Yeah, so... Uh, well, that's not... Oh, look at that bosk in the pink that's outfit. Not, that's that's not cool. Bootleg. That's separation of twins there, I figure. That's quite expensive. That's not a bootleg, isn't it? Why not? How's that? Well, look at that pink bosk. I don't know. I'm the boat legs, but... That pink know. bosk is uh, different. I, I'm <laughs> yeah. digging that, man. I, 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 I kind of want that. It's John only $17. Wants it. let's, have a, let's have a click on it. <laughs> Best yeah, let's have a click put, on put an offering on it. Yes, let's have a, yeah. John's oh, having a look now. Pink bosk. <laughs> it's just so unique looking. you got to have something, you know. Yeah, well, that's cool they're, so, they're so good. Oh, look at that. Oh, is that Hasbro <laughs> <laughs> versus Star Wars? 
Oh my god. They I mean, don't look that different than they don't look that different than they did look back then. I mean that Princess Zizor looks a lot like my Prince Zizor. <laughs> yeah, we're so we're looking at the Galaxy Empire ones. I will look. Yeah, that's kind of what I mean. Like they're those are like things that you might have found at a dollar store or something. Yeah, you know? I remember those. I can remember those and, back in the nineties. I think. And, uh, yeah, yeah, I remember the fat. The fat's still quite popular, isn't it? Yeah. Because I'm saying, like, right now, there's like a ripoff Spider-Man and Captain America and Thor at my dollar stores, you know, and they're. I'm just like, oh, is this one of those things that I should buy, you know? Because in three or four years, they're going to be worth a hundred dollars. Oh, you on. know, that's interesting. It looks like Cobra Commander's head on Darth Vader's body, <laughs> and you get a mask as well. Twenty-four pound. Darth Vader arms and legs with a snowtrooper chest piece and yeah. a Cobra Commander head. Knock up Watto. That's uh, a custom, Ozai. <laughs> oh, let's look at. Sounds to Valarum. Oh, no, it's not. I thought it was Valarum. It's not, is it? It's uh, Palpatine. <laughs> Palpatine. That's amazing. Oh, ten pound, no bid. So wonder why. <laughs> hey, Roger. What's that, Darth Vader? That's crazy. Battle droid. Look at that. Now that's quality. <laughs> Chris, the get the guns. Oh, that's quality. <laughs> See these. These are probably worth a lot. And if you maybe not. That pink mask is. What's that Darth Vader? Yeah, what is that? Oh, isn't that that things that are in like the. Uh... That is so weird. Yeah, that is looks that... like. Is that a thing you find in that workshop, bookshop thing, places you get everywhere? We, we get. Is it workshop books or whatever? There was like that one in a stormtrooper. I'm sure of it. It's rare. It's so <laughs> weird. Yeah, it poses all right. It? it poses, right? Maybe Man, it, can't, it can't be that. It can't be that rare. I mean, it's like only 14. It's baby Vader. <laughs> how how tall, tall is that? That's good. Is that like. Is it eluding? Is it like an illusion? Like, it's it really, is it really only like three inches tall? But to me, it looks know. like it's got to be like a 10 or 12 inch thing, you know? But yeah. Looks about, about six inch, I would have thought. Starfighter. Oh, look at that. Come on, Oh, look at that Chewie. <laughs> With the shaved top, top on his head shaved off. The other one, yeah. But Look at that. Nice red gun, that's cool. Yeah, I quite like that. Go I, was looking at the, I was looking at the bounty hunter Chewbacca that was a couple up front oh, that yeah, has yeah, the, yeah. the shaved head. Yeah, oh. the shaved head one. Yeah. Oh, but, like, yeah. Shadow of the Empire one, isn't it? Yeah. So, uh, yeah, they've just made it bigger. In different colors. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dear. What do they call that? A crop top? He crop the tops all? Yeah. Two back express and Shadow. Yeah, Shadow, yeah. Shadow of the Empire, yeah. Yeah. They just copied it and made it bigger, didn't they? Do you see that? Did you see the right, pictures right. of someone done a custom six inch one? That's on Facebook at the moment. It's been doing the rounds. It's really good, really detailed. So, no. The Shadows of the Empire. No, yeah. 
All it's right. been going doing the, doing the rounds past couple of days. It looks really good. Yeah. Roger says, "Where's Bella?" Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, I've actually, actually she actually liked my comment today, so it might take her a while. She liked your comment. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So we're getting there. <laughs> is that the was she? Is that, is that something about Evil Knievel or something? Is it Evil Knievel? Oh, she did Evil Knievel today. Yeah. Yeah. She managed to get a bulb, isn't it? Oh, of course. Yeah. A couple of times, actually. It was quite, it was quite an interesting video, actually. It was quite... Um... <laughs> it's different for her. <laughs> I mean, she, she, you, want, you want me to put it on, don't you? No. No. <laughs> no. I just, think, I, I just say, like you say, it's interesting. So... Uh... Uh, no, 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 I mean that sincerely, actually. Yeah, it was, yeah. Um, different for her. Yeah, she was doing not rubbish. She was doing, she was doing something decent for a change. Yeah. Yeah, no. Yeah. Well, no, I won't go that far. <laughs> All right. Yeah, because that's the. Is this the new Evil Knievel from Studio Creations? Isn't it? Yeah. The one that's been released in America. Yeah. I wonder they're going to. I looked on see if they were going to release it over here or not. I'm so, saying. Roger, this is for you. Oh. Look at that. <laughs> There's no need for that. Yeah. Well, go on. I'm surprised she's oh. not doing it in a bikini. Oops, oops, oops. oops. <laughs> uh, flicking through them. Oh. There we go. I turned the chat. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm wearing my Honda racing t shirt. Why? It just kind of slips down there. I'm just going to have to. She's interviewing yeah. Evil Knievel, which is um, about weird, but incredible jump there you go. he's going to do. Right now, he's prepping in his scramble van, so let's go over and have a talk. She's not very good oh, at editing. too loud. Evil yeah. Knievel is getting ready. She's prepping. not very good at editing. We are going to way. knock on his door and ask him how he feels about tonight. And this <laughs> amazing. I know how I feel. <laughs> All right. We're going to knock. <sighs> Yeah. Evil, are you in there? Evil looks <clears> like he's getting ready still. Let's get him out. Evil's walking down the stairs. I think she's lost it, basically. She's stand <laughs> his, his Let's go ahead. She's, and not, she's not making the voices, though. She's going to be like, hey, I'm yeah, Evil. Can you go? Oh, that's All right, Evil. How do you feel about tonight? Okay, I can see you're not in All right, guys, it looks like Evil decided to get into his Evil Knievel car, um, and he is going to race around, show us some awesome things he could do. Uh, right, I'm going to fuck off a little bit to the bit where she's right. talking you know, as him. I feel like Evil is going to be able to stick this landing, no problem. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, Isn't that a quote from Elvis? Oh, okay. We all use the same quotes. All right. And what do you think? Oh, about his jump tonight. Uh, I'm crap. I don't really say much. I'm gonna squall. <laughs> oh, okay. So he thinks you're gonna do great. Evil, tell us what he thinks about your jump tonight. Uh, oh, I think he's gonna stick it. He's gonna stick that landing real well. He's gonna jump over everything that you put in front of him. There's no stopping evil tonight. You hear that, Evil? Your friend's got your back. Can't wait to see what you jump over. Hanging out with an awesome Evil Scramble van. Let's go to well, the jump. You can see that. You can see that me and John are really well impressed, and we are not interested in the slightest. <laughs> hey, I'm, 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 I'm already hunting for new stuff on eBay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, come on, Mark. <laughs> you ready for this? In place. Yeah, it's not going to oh, work, I, is it? Or is it? Oh, oh, oh. I'm gonna oh. Sod off. I've already got it. No, my my friend in New York is under quarantine, and she's a hairdresser. Watch this. And she's like, she doesn't have any like thing going on because she's a hairdresser. So yeah. Look at that. Mm. Wake the whole street up. <laughs> Good <laughs> jump. What the original? Yeah. That came in there that you go. With the, it actually works. There's a couple. There's, there's a couple of really good Facebook uh, pages. Uh, so, with Evil Knievel guys, and they just dump their bikes. 
see. In the streets. So, so. Uh, Evil Could Evil is pretty badass. That's why I'm wearing this badass t shirt. Oh. <laughs> so, that was pretty awesome. I had fun. I enjoyed doing it. It was late into the night. So, this time yeah. I will leave you with this. Evil Knievel is pretty badass. The toy was awesome. Um, older is definitely better. That's my. I agree favorite. with that. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I agree with that. <laughs> You're all speechless. Yeah. <laughs> yep. 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 <laughs> you guys are clearly wrong. Doing it wrong. Trying to actually yeah. inform people about retro toys, etc. <laughs> yeah. Well, I know. Well, you know, if you guys really want to, I can. <laughs> oh. <laughs> God, <laughs> right, I'm going to get serious oh. now. I've got my. That's it. No more. <laughs> no more that. Mm, never again. Please, please. Uh, <laughs> I, want to know, I want to know your guys's. Um... <clears throat> This article from Ble Bleeding Fall, they've, they've snatched it from somebody else, obviously. Yeah, I put a Diamond wrong toys. picture up. Yeah, Diamond I, Toys. I, I, I disagree. I mean, uh, if there were no demand, you wouldn't have anybody, everybody on Twitter screaming that there's no toys at Walmart when they go to the section. Yeah. But the thing is, Diamond Toys, how, how often make, do you see those? Diamond Toys make well, Diamond Select bought Gentle Giant out, so they own Gentle Giant now. So they yeah. make all the busts and all that, and the mallet and all the statues. So uh, and but, supply but a lot of other toys. Gentle Giant were put, were, were advertising, they were pushing them, and people were buying yeah, them. And then suddenly, people uh, collected them. Uh, I've not seen them for yeah. years. Exactly. They, I was collecting them like they would have like three or four out every month. And they were at like they were like thirty, forty pound or a reasonable price. And they suddenly went, "Now nah, we're not doing that anymore. We just release a couple a year, and we'll charge you over a hundred quid now for each one." You're like, "Well, hang on, you were charging us thirty quid uh, when they first come out, and now you want uh, extortionate amount of money." And then they got this. Is it? They've got a premier guild or something where you can get certain figures. And uh, you have to pay. You have to be a subs You have to be a member of it or something. But yeah, General Giant. Then they released those big vintage figures, didn't they? Yeah. Um, no one wanted. No one. They're nice, but they just got nowhere to put them all. So, uh, I mean, I've got behind me. I've got busts or this side. Well, yeah. I, here, I've got friends so. who used to collect them all the time. Yeah. Yeah. My wife got a load of Harry Potter ones, so she loves the Harry Potter ones. And then they just well, stopped. Funny. And What's funny about the oversized vintage ones is that I decided, like, when they were starting to come out, I was like, well, I'm going to wait for something I really want, like a Yoda or, you know, just just get one figure, you know, because obviously you can't get the whole set because where are you going to put them all? So yeah. I was, but then huh. by the time they did, like, a Yoda or something, it's like every time I saw the Yoda, I missed it when he was for sale from General Giant. And every time I yeah. went to go find it, were like a hundred or two hundred dollars, and I'm like, well, I don't want to spend that on it, you know, like. <laughs> yeah, I mean they've they've just released the the, the Tron figures, which I reviewed, yeah. which I've got, and they've just done the black hole tri uh, figures. They've done Maximilian and, and the uh, the uh, what's the two little round robots? I forgot they call now. Vincent um, and Vincent and um, yeah, yeah, so the got, other Bob got, Bob. Vincent and Bob. Yeah. I said Bob. Yeah, the crushed, the damaged one. Yeah. So I've got two of those figures there on the screen. There's top. I've got top two of them. Yeah. So, um, but I haven't got the the Flynn infil infiltrator, which is the red one on the on the left there. But um, yeah, the the black hole ones are amazing. So, uh, but it's they're just hard to get over here. So uh, again, it's just they don't don't release them over here. Looking at the list there, there's no there's no Star Wars anywhere. It's Star Trek, Ghostbusters, it's for the Mandalorian the figures. Didn't they have Mandalorian figure up when I saw it? No, no. Um, yeah, they're not talk. They're talking to Diamond Select. They're not talking to Hasbro, aren't they? So they're making it out. Well, the price that what, what I mean, the, the price point of these Diamond Selects are so expensive. Compared so with the Hasbro, 
Oh, we're yeah. getting with the sculpts and looking really good. Yeah. So what? You basically but, said getting the same figure as yeah. you had with Hasbro, but you're paying a lot less with Hasbro. Mm, yeah. I've seen the Westworld. Yeah, the bust, I, like, I like the Westworld ones. The busts and that. I mean, they say they were like thirty to forty pounds. They were, and then now they're over a hundred. Some are two hundred, and uh, collectors who collect General Giant just can't. I mean, they don't bring them out as many now, so people can save up and collect one at a time. I mean, I, mean, I just got a, yeah, I've got a recent one here. <laughs> I'm mean, gonna buy those. And and those are six inch. Those are six inch. Seven inch. This is my. This is my. Uh, One hundred twenty dollars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah they are, they're, they're absolutely fantastic. Yeah, this hmm. is my look, gentle giant Luke Last Jedi bust. So I think this is brilliant. This one. Yeah. So, but this was on. Um, this was on Amazon, and they, they reduced it. I kept watching it. It was like eighty. Then he went down to like 70 and uh, hi lucky had like a 10 pound thing because i got the app so i got this for like just 60 quid so it's it's a great bust i mean yeah I always... what, what this guy is, is talking about is the the disney area the disney era uh characters but obviously that's in a disney <laughs> era film but it's, it still looks yeah. skywalker <clears throat> Yeah, I think they're saying that the the new the sequel trilogy has not done the merchandise like the original trilogy, isn't it? So that's what they're saying as well. The characters they've picked to sell are not selling as exactly. well as the original trilogy. That's so, probably the same thing. Yeah. This, I mean, I'm watching a video, Clownfish, I was, they were talking about this, and they were looking at this picture here. Oh, hang on. I'll put it on. Look at this picture here, and they were berating how bored that Ray looks, but that's not Diamond Select. That's Hasbro figures. They're Hasbro yeah. figures. Yeah, yeah, that's the box set. They get all four in. So yeah. they cocked that up for straight away. So yeah. well well yeah. what I what I the way I took the article was that Diamond Select doesn't don't they also distribute they toys distribute, to comic yeah, book shops? They do, yeah. So they'll just they'll distribute Hasbro toys to a comic book store. Not yeah. a well, not like a, they won't do a Walmart or a uh, Toys R like well Toys R Us is gone, but you know like any of the big outlets toy stores no, but they will to a comic book because most comics come from Diamond Select. I thought like that's the main distributor for comic yeah. books. It is, yeah, it is, yeah, yeah. So, but but that like the the co the comic book stores that I know around my area, they're like well. We try what we do. Like, there's one guy who's like, what I do is I go with the four or five other stores around the neighborhood, and together, if we put in an order, <laughs> we have enough. They're like, we have enough of a quantity to where we can have an account with Hasbro. But yeah. every time we make an order with Hasbro Direct, <laughs> we have to have like order like 20 cases. So we so every store has to be on board when we put yeah. the order in, because a single store can't afford to order as many direct from Hasbro because oh, yeah. because Diamond Select for like the 799 5 POA figure that was out for the last Jedi or whatever you know um Diamond Select would charge you like $12 for that figure mm. so the, the store so then the store would have to sell it for 15 bucks but Walmart's got it for 799 yeah. so they're like we, yeah. we can't compete if you get it from Diamond Select you can't compete with the Walmart or any of the yeah. other shops. You know, the major shops. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. So that's why Diamond Select isn't selling Star Wars toys. It's because they can't get them to sell them at the low price that a Walmart sells them at. And this, so, as Rebellion just said, the characters as well they're picking. I mean, uh, yeah. a, uh, a Finn, a Finn Gentle Giant bust. I mean, they came out at. Um, they were coming out of like four, no, what is it, uh, 80 yeah. or 100, and now they're on Zavi for like less than 30. They can't get rid of them. They can't get rid of them. <laughs> they're on Zavi <laughs> now. I mean, thing. Zavi. Would you rather Zavi's have a paper figure or a Kylo Ren? Yeah. 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 So many Kylo Ren figures in the past few years. 
I mean, Kylo yeah, Ren, I, I, I think, is a really good character. Probably one of the yeah. best characters in the in the yeah, sequel trilogy. But yeah, uh, well, I'd rather I'd rather have a Ben Solo. I'd like a Ben Solo. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, that, he was more interesting than Kylo Ren to me. Yeah. He's, well, I'm I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm just waiting. Now. I'm just <laughs> waiting for the uh, Empire slash Jedi Darth Vader because I got my Star Wars Darth Vader up there fighting Ben Kenobi, but. Luke Jedi is standing there all alone. He's got no one Aww. to fight. Oh. Oh. I'll be out next year or year after. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. I have I've got but I've got Kylo Ren from Force Awakens Black Series. Kylo Ren unmasked Black Series from Force Awakens. Yeah. Kylo yeah. Ren with the scar unmasked from Force Awakens. Kylo Ren from um, Last Jedi. Last Jedi with a mask on. Kylo Ren without the mask from Last Jedi. Kylo Ren with a mask that's black <laughs> from um, Do you think Rise you of enough? Skywalker. From Rise of Skywalker 3-pack. <laughs> then I got Kylo Ren with the red on his helmet. Then Kylo Ren with no mask from Rise of Skywalker. Yeah. So yeah. it's like, I've got 12 Kylo different Kylo Reds already in the Star Wars really Black you're keeping us going. Many. Yeah, you <laughs> think Randley keeping us going. You don't need that many Kylo Rens, do you? You no. just need one without one with the helmet. <laughs> one without, yeah. Yeah. I'm just saying that's yeah. how many were released. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. there's the one because the one in the three pack is different than the one that had the red helmet, you know? But they got the same yeah. body from, from Rise of Skywalker. Maybe. So, Maybe it's a time to have a purge from the Kylos. Yeah, like, <laughs> going back this this article, I just I just think it's I wouldn't say it's not badly written, but it's, it's just, just it's, the it's way given the rant it, is more appeal, it's, isn't it? It's just uh, I mean the way the way it's written, I mean, look at this. The sad reality is there isn't any demand for them, even as the small handful of SJWs can continue to screech about. Oh, come on, man. I mean, I yeah. uh, I don't I don't like the term SJWs anyway. I mean, I know I know it's I don't even thing. know. I don't even know what it means. It's <laughs> It's the people that don't like white men like us. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's 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 like people think that Kathleen Kennedy's one of these. Well, what does it stand for? Is what I'm saying. Um, or can we not say the actual words that no, it stands for? Yeah, it's, um, okay, all right. Then never mind. I, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's just so. I gotta, family. I gotta ask. I gotta ask, boss here. Well, social so justice you, warrior. That's what it is. Boss, Social justice well, warrior. Oh, okay. That's what I it got is. you. It's just yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the so boss. Have you have you seen the pink boss? <laughs> Did he see that bit we were panning through? <laughs> yeah, it was I like don't... that pink, that pink outfit boss looked pretty cool. So I'm wondering it if goes, it, goes on. <laughs> it goes on. The lessons that the He-Man and the Master of the Universe Thailand taught us 40 years ago, which I point out in my recent documentary. Will never be heeded by idiot SJWs. You know what I mean? It's yeah. just <sighs> I don't like the fandom menace. I don't like SJW. Right. What am I then? Right. Yeah. I'm just a white man that's in the middle. <laughs> yeah, so just oh. this is just what a uh... Russian bootleg, the pink one. Yeah, yeah. We saw we saw a loose one for like seventeen pound on on eBay there. <laughs> But <laughs> this this guy that's wrote this this article is Ichibaka. It's called Ichibaka. Oh. <laughs> so we, <laughs> we, know he, we know what he's doing at the moment. Uh, just an old Star Wars fan since the very beginning. Check out my blog at Disney Star Wars is dumb dot wordpress dot com. Yeah. So that is his blog. So we can tell where he is. So he hates yeah. Disney, basically, and he's writing this crap. <laughs> oh, because he hates Disney. So it's a biased article, really. That's exactly. all you have to take from Exactly. Yeah. So, I mean, we're, we're publicizing it, really, but. Uh, yeah, I'm not making any bias. Yeah. Yeah. I've got a Bosque Focus collector on the newest episode. All oh, right. Oh, yeah, I know. Right. Just, we've just been showing it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're going to listen to it when we've done this. Well, I am, anyway. You won't be able to find it now. I wanted to have a look at it properly. <laughs> what, the boss? The pink boss, yeah. Can you log, have a look at it? 
John's interest as well. I think John wants a bid on it. <laughs> it's been it's been on it's been on eBay for for years. It was so <laughs> unique looking. I was like, "What is that thing?" Even, you know, like that has been on eBay yeah. for years. Nineteen nineties, probably the first two. Sure. But, but you just don't see something like that, and it's the last thing you would ever think. think of. Oh, is it in America? That is it in the US? Yeah. Oh, there you go, John. Perfect. There you go. Boy, treat yourself. Twenty-two dollars. Twenty-two. Yeah. He's gonna have it. He's gonna have it. <laughs> <laughs> he's already bought it. Yeah, he's already bought it. <laughs> he's going to go off now. Yeah, he's quick, 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 quick available. John will get it for like ten dollars or something, won't he? Yeah. Six well, available. No... Oh, he's got to make an offer. Yeah, there you go. I'll make him an 166 offer. Hundred and sixty-six sold. Hundred and sixty-six. So he had hundred and seventy-two of them. Wow! 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 Well, there's a few about then. Guess so. <laughs> <laughs> Much better. Is that is that the metallic green is super super rare, huh? Get a version of the pink one. Well, that's not very rare, is it? It's 172 of them. <laughs> <laughs> well, he says the, the the metallic green is the really rare one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. That that's not a legitimate. But like, that's from 1990. I mean, it is, yeah, but uh, it's not like one from the 80s. See, no. like if if I were to do something like, like you know, because I got the giant Yoda collection there, you know, that goes. There's like a thousand Yodas in that cabinet. Um, so if I were to do something like Bosk, I'd have to call it like Yoda's Yurt. What would I be? <laughs> I don't know. Definitely he's, different, yeah, he's, isn't it? He's my Yoda's my focus guy, so yeah. Now, if so, if there were a pink Yoda, I'd be going right for it, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's about like of the part of the fast version, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's modern, yeah, yeah. But like Russian, though, isn't it? yeah, so, yeah. They're nice. Some of them, I mean, the uh, uh, I don't think. Uh, I I just want to get the the vintage, the proper vintage ones. But yeah, this yeah, I mean, yeah. if if somebody's offered me those, I I'd just like to snap their hands off. You know what I mean? But yeah, Blue Stars uh, Trooper. Oh, yeah, that. Oh, oh, yeah. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I'll type. I'll, I'll see if there's any on. There'll be customs, I know. Yeah, you, I've seen people. Yeah, respray them. So. Yeah. Uh. See, I like that. Yeah, that one. But I'd, I'd like them carded, and then the uh, I really like that Imperial Gunner with the calculator. The the card is just so funny, you know. Yeah, yeah. Like just like a card, wouldn't you? Yeah, that's that's the only I way I want them like... carded. Yeah. But the gunner itself isn't that different, right? He's pretty much. Um, he has okay. the metallic green boss too. Action figure grader. He collects and grades, doesn't he? But has serious bootleg collecting. Polish bootlegs, yeah. Okay. Action figure grader. Right. Ah. I'll check it out. Yeah. Got that out. No, Bella's still on. <laughs> <laughs> Action figure grader. <clears throat> so, uh, are you guys looking forward to that Mandalorian, the um, making of series? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I can't wait for that. That's yeah, it's come out today. That series three's in the in the already been in uh, the works. Yeah, already in yeah. the works. Yeah. yeah. And uh, so, uh, Jamie Lee Jamie Lee Curtis is not in it now. She's film doing a film now instead or something. <clears throat> she's really right. to be in it. Yeah, she's making a film now, so she's had to pull out of it. So, yeah. Hmm. 
See what I what I wonder about it, like when they announce something like that, when they say it's already in the works, does that mean that season two is finished filming, like the entire season? I think it yeah, is. Yeah, it's all done. Yeah, they filmed it in January, didn't they? Yeah, January, yeah. I think most yeah. of it's done. All the filming, so it takes, all the special so effects. It takes, it takes that much work in post production for it, so it's more. Yeah. Less about the actual filming of it where the actors involved and more about the special effects that come yeah, afterwards. Like green, cool, because they have green the green. L L C D screens around them. So all the all the the yeah. location ones are done in, in a studio because it's all yeah. greens. It's amazing. Yeah. That's done in the, that's done in the filming process. I'm saying after filming when they let the actors go home. Oh yeah. Like if if that was done in January, you know, so all the like adding laser bolts and other things, yeah, sound effects and yeah, all the time. Yeah, that's the Green Bosk. Yeah, nice that. Yeah, yeah I subscribe. I subscribe to him, so uh, watch that later. There's yeah. something funny about there being as many. Episodes. It's like I suppose it's like. When they used to watch Rebels, there used to be some after that, didn't there? And, yeah, uh, they just they just show a bit of each episode animated, wouldn't they? Yeah, 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 yeah. I think they're just they're they're desperate to they were desperate to fill some time up before something yeah. else gets released. Desperately get people like, back on Disney, yeah. Because here's here's my thought on it. You know, I was just today canceling my subscription to CBS because Picard is over, and I was like, that's that's how a lot of people do stuff. My brother and I order CBS when Star Trek starts. And when Star Trek ends, we cancel it. So we don't keep CBS the whole year round. And I'm like, that's how some people are with Disney+. Plus. They only, they only got it when Mandalorian and now when Clone Wars are coming out. But when there's no Star Wars coming out, they're not going to have it. They're going to cancel their subscription. So that's what I'm saying. If you were Disney... Why wouldn't you put out one Star Wars thing every single week? It could be Mandal for these nine weeks. It could be Mandalorian. As soon as Mandalorian ends, it's Clone Wars. As soon as Clone Wars ends, it's say making of Mandalorian. As soon as man making of ends, it's Kenobi. As soon as Kenobi ends, it's Mandalorian season two. As soon as that ends, it's Cassian. You know what I mean? Like never have a break. Oh, Just every man. single week, every single week there's a new Star Wars. You'll keep people year round. Yeah. But they God, don't. They yeah. don't do that. They don't do that, and it's like, what are you brain yeah. dead? You know, like. Well, <laughs> but the problem is, Asbro wouldn't be able to keep up, would they? <laughs> we'd, be, <laughs> we'd be moaning. Even, we'd be even moaning even more, wouldn't we? So. Uh... <laughs> yeah, cause didn't they say that um, they weren't sh they weren't allowed to see all the all Rise of Skywalker? So that's why half of the figures haven't been done. Yeah, so we're going to get the Rise of Skywalker figures next. This. Upcoming Christmas, uh, I don't know, again, any, I don't think we're going to get any Rise of Skywalker figures. Really, don't. Well, we'll get a couple. But what yeah, figures? I, we'll I mean, a pattern of them we're, occasionally. There's too we're many more figures. All, we already got all the main characters. I like a John Williams. <laughs> yeah, a John yeah. Williams. Yeah. Yeah. I want more Return of the Jedi figures. Ben Solo. <laughs> yeah. Wow. yeah. Well. Definitely. I'd rather Ben survive than uh, Ray, to be honest with you, but never mind. <laughs> I think they both should have died. That's <laughs> <laughs> the yeah, ultimate like sacrifice to, to save the galaxy. That, we? That, um, that bit at the end, was it? The, I got the picture here, haven't we? We were talking about that character, weren't we, at the end of... Um, End of yeah. the film. Yeah, I found the picture. Yeah. yeah. This is from the yeah, artwork like, book, isn't it? Yeah. That is just yeah. that. It's Black Series. That and, well, 3.75. That's just asking to be made, isn't it? So. Yeah. It would look cool. Yeah. It would look awesome. Yeah. A couple of them. Yeah. Bib Fortuna agreed. Yeah. 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 Big Fortuna. Um, Ula the Dancer. That'd be another good one. Ula. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Huh? I've met her. <laughs> yeah, I've, I've got I've got a picture somewhere with her. Yeah. Oh, I still got it on here. Yeah. 
Still looks seven. Okay. It's weird. Huh? She still looks yeah. seven. Weird. It's weird. Different. Yeah, she's yeah. She's not changed at all. No. Yeah, I'm just watching this uh, boat like this little <laughs> boat like it's really good. Go to that green one. Has he got shoulder pads? What is that? How does he? What are the shoulder I, pads? I don't know. Oh, that's the just plastic plastic made in. Yeah. Yeah. It's a bit oh, they're in. his clips yeah. holding them in. I see. I see. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. That's nice. Why that? Oh. They look like prototype, like before they're um, painted. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, definitely more Return of Jedi. Well, we're getting an Ewok, aren't we? So. Uh, yeah, but the wrong one. There should have been oh, packs. They'll, of those, so. they'll do. They'll do a few. I'm guessing they're going to do more. I bet they're yeah. just doing this one just to see if it sells or not, and then they'll do more Ewoks. Yeah. Bang. Look we'll yeah. the I think they should have done a couple packs, though. They should do because there's so many Ewoks you could do that it's like you're gonna want you're gonna want Poplu, you're gonna want Tebo, you're gonna want Low Gray, you're gonna want Chief Chirper, and you're gonna want Wicket. Like you should have done two, like two, three packs. And yeah, they have done Chief Chirper. That was the first one. Yeah. Is he the, is he the first one? Was the Chief Chirper or was it Low Gray? Chief Chirper came or was out. Was it Tebo? No, I thought it was Chirper. Tebow, the gray uh, and Tebow, the dark gray, light gray striped one. I think Tebow was third, third one to come out. I mean the Black Series. I think oh, the dark Black gray, light gray Tebow one. Tebow was the first one to come out, yeah. Yeah. It don't look too bad, actually. I quite like it. It's very good. Yeah, I'm getting it. Yeah, yeah. It looks really good. The fur looks good on it. Wait, hold so. on. I'll be right back. Boss man. Boss man. <laughs> What's that? It must be. It must be for him to run that fast. It must be the first one. You know, another parcel. Yeah. 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 Well, another live unboxing. Yeah. Yeah. So we can get a parcel. One of those two of those bosses have ever come out for sale. Whew. I bet they were expensive. What the green ones? Yeah. Yeah. Metallic. Oh. Yeah. Oh, he's going to get some figures. Oh. I, I thought I thought the postman had come. No, no, it's like I was seeing that Bosk. Like, take a look at C-3PO here. See how it looks like that Bosk looks like, you know, an unpainted, an unpainted figure. You know Real what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. yeah. So... Like this is the Kenner C three PO before he's painted in the chrome, in the yeah. metallic. You class. know? And sometimes they were like this, you know, like they're just the the light's too bright. Hold on. <laughs> Don't tell I so well to see you. <laughs> see how he's like a almost pure white. Yeah. Yeah. Like a yellowish yeah. white, you know. Yeah. So but it's like that those bosks just remind me of this, you know, like it's like an unpainted figure where they just use whatever plastic they have lying around and you know. There you go. Yeah, that one especially. Yeah. You can tell it is it's larger because the mold would have been larger. Oh, gotcha. But mine aren't, these three peels are not prototypes. They're basically unpainted figures, you know, or un All right. unfinished. You know what I, what do you, what do you call them? So what, the, what they're doing is they've got the figure made a mold around it. So obviously that is going to, if they put plastic into it, it's going to be bigger. So it's quite, mm. it's, it's a bit bigger. That's why that is. 
Pink and green bosque lizard, lizard limbs swivel can be removed from the body. Ah. 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 Interesting. Yeah. So it's, it's, I mean, I was saying most of the boat legs were in the 80s, late 80s, middle late 80s, but uh, that's in the 90s, obviously. Brown the Force 2. Yeah. Well, that, that, that wave in the 90s probably only came to the United States, right? They were still, that was sort of a test thing. They didn't realize, they didn't know if it would really work, I think. I don't know. I'm just thinking about Russia. I mean, Russia in the 90s was just coming around, wasn't they? The communism was falling, and uh, it's just strange that they're doing bootlegs in, in the 90s. Well, like I said, what if they weren't getting them? You know what I mean? Like, they just got G.I. Joe. Like, those, if you look at the back of those fun school G.I. Oh, Joe they, figures, they, you'll got, see, like, you'll see like the original date that the figure was released. So like some of mine say like 82, 83, but then they say 1991 or 1992 yeah. next to it. Cause that's the Russian release. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So yeah. Yeah. we got the figure in like 83, but R Russia got it as, on a fun school package in like 1992. So it's kind of like Hasbro just reused those molds, made new figures and opened up a new market in Russia once the you know the wall was down and everything was open. Yeah. <clears throat> you know. And then they named them international heroes, not um American yeah, heroes. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. yeah like the no. UK, yeah. So yeah. Yeah. So it's just interesting just uh, things like this that crop up. It's I mean that's come from a question from one of his viewers. So it's just nice to have have people watching and asking those questions. So we can just go down a yeah. path. We'll put the <laughs> no more than we do. Yeah. <laughs> just keeps you going, doesn't it? You start talking about different things. Yeah. Learn something. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that comes from yeah. the rebellion question at the beginning. Yeah. Yeah, we're, yeah. No, we're no amazing experts. We just uh, like talking about stuff. Yeah, we, yeah, that's it. We know we know quite a bit about stuff, but so we don't know everything. That's what I said in my video earlier on. It's just nice. It's nice to learn about everything. Yeah. 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 Well, I was talking with I was talking with the guys at Blacked Out Ewoks that like it's only this last year of my life that I've even discussed things related to the COO marks on figures. Yeah. Nobody in the collecting clubs in Seattle ever talked about that. And I know some of the some of the biggest collectors in the world that live in Seattle, and they've never talked about COO marks. And then suddenly, the last year, it's like all anyone is talking about is COO marks. And I'm like, I was talking with Blacked Out Ewoks, like, so I'm learning a million new things about these figures that I've collected my whole life just in the last few months. And a lot learning a lot from Blacked Out Ewoks because he always talks about COO marks and the differences between them. You know? Yeah. So yeah. what 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 factories were you getting your figures from back in seventies and eighties? Then was it just Hong Kong or was it Taiwan and China? We never or... cared. We never cared. We didn't look at the back of the figure. No one cared. If you had a figure, you had a figure. So I just wondered if America mm -hmm. just got one factory worth because being in Europe, we might have got different factories. I guess I don't know because uh, yeah. I've... All the different that's what I mean. I, in Europe. I, that's what I mean. I have no idea because no one talked about it in the in Seattle, you know? So, so I've got my finger. If you had if you had a Jawa, you had a Jawa. It didn't matter what mark was on it, you had it, you know. So all that mattered was you had one in your collection, regardless. So it wasn't until I moved here and started talking with all of you guys and blacked out Ewoks and stuff that I started realizing that there's different marks even to begin with, you know. And so different marks I'll, mean different I'll, things, I'll, and sometimes they're different especially values. Especially in Europe. Especially yeah. in Europe. All the different licensees. So I'm just wondering whether that's uh, that might be it. Uh, we got different factories. Yeah. 
Yeah, Hong Kong, Taiwan, <coughs> few Mexico. Oh, a Polish like a Death Star gunner. I'll meet in Mexico, yeah. Wait till the yeah. chat comes off. <laughs> be... <laughs> yeah, it's good. It's just, it's just my, it's great to learn from each other. That's that's the whole point of these just well, these chats really. Mm. Yeah, oh yeah, US is mostly on car. I thought it would be. Some some Taiwan and fuel figures are made in Mexico. Yeah. Mexico, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, I, th I thought it would be something like that. Yes, in Canada, Loma and Poplo want to do their cards are all made in Mexico. Ah, that's interesting. Mm. And, like, so, I'm going to do some, like, speaking of, like, the interesting figures, like, I've got the test shot, the test shot of the, two, it's the 2003 clone trooper, yeah. highly, articula highly articulated one. Nice. And um, I so I was I've been I don't have a figure of this painted, you know, a real one. But this is like the prototype test shot that you get that Hasbro would do to test the mold. Yeah. And mm. um, <clears throat> I just found I just found a guy. Finally, I found a guy on on eBay who was selling a whole bunch of clone troopers. And I wrote him and I said, oh, do you happen to have the 2003? And he's like, yeah. He goes, I've got the green painted, the blue painted, the white, plain white, the yellow and the red. But the yellow and red are more expensive because they were more rare. But he goes, I can shoot you the blue one, the green one, and the plain white one for 250 each. So for like, you know, 750 right? Yeah. I got three of the figures out of the five that were made using this mold. Right. So I'm thinking now I might do a shadow box, like frame it and stand each stand this guy up and then have the yeah. like this with a little plaque yeah. that says this is the test. That plaque and have a slot in the end. The yeah. test slot and then no slot. It's the no slot one. No antenna. Yeah. The belt is the belt is different. That's the thing you got to look for. I was looking at all the belts. Yeah. The belt around his waist, and um, that's the part that it's thin. It's thin in the back. There with like no pouch. Where a lot of other ones have two pouches in the back. Yeah. So it's like um, pretty specific. Yeah, it's nice that. Very nice. But yeah, I, I was like, because I've always wondered how I can display how I can display this guy properly. Mm. And then I just thought yeah. of that. I was like, well, if I get all the ones that were produced. And stand them up next to them in a shadow box and make a little plaque that says what each version is. Yeah. Kind of be like a a little display that shows the production and how it's done, you know? Oh, definitely. Mm -hmm. Sounds good to me. And I could do a video on it once I have the figures. Yeah. Yeah, it's always good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Same with these. I should do a video on the unpainted. Yeah, the, un the unfinished ones, you know. That was that was a thing a while ago, wasn't it? People were stripping C three POs, weren't they, to see what yeah. what color were underneath. And that was sort of a poo pooed. I think a lot of people. And were. I think I actually think this one is stripped because yeah. I can see in in the little nooks and crannies, I can still see bits of his color. So I think this is a stripped one. All right. But I found I yeah. found both of these both of these were lying in a box underneath the table at like a swap shop kind of thing. Really? And um I, I looked at I, I was going through the box and I pulled these two out and I'd never seen anything like this before. So I said, What do you wow. want for these? And he's like, Oh, ten dollars for both. And I was like, Okay, you know, I go, I don't know. You know, and he's like, "That's five dollars each." And then I went; it clicked in my brain. I thought he wanted ten dollars each, so I was like thinking twenty was too high. But then when he was like, yeah. "No, just five bucks each, ten dollars for both," and I was like, "Oh, that, yeah, there you go." <laughs> so I didn't know what the, I didn't know what they were when I found them. But then I've just got some uh, DMs on the Twitter. Uh, chocolate chip, okay, Marky, as um, yeah, Mark. I've just been sending me some photos of some uh, prototypes he's got. Uh, I'm just telling oh, him, just come on, why didn't come, just come on, chat, mate. He's, he's watching us, but he's, he's sending me, <laughs> sending me DMs on Twitter. Is, 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 uh, he on, is, he on, is he on YouTube? I tried to find him. I couldn't find him on YouTube. 
I don't, is he on YouTube? I don't, I don't think you're on YouTube, are you, Mark? No. Is he on uh, Facebook? Watching you guys talk protos and bootlegs, here's a Leia Bespin escape I got from Mexico a few years back. <laughs> uh, I, can't, I can't share my screen at the moment, but uh, it is very nice. I can't get it on me. I'll see if I can... Uh, Got Mark's got a, the... He's got a nice collection. He's got a really good set of stuff there. See that? Yep. Leia, is that? Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah. Best spin escape layer. Nice. And. Oh. Oh, the six. <laughs> yeah, that girl. Yeah, he's going to say it then, wouldn't he? <laughs> That's Bella <laughs> times. Three, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nice. <laughs> yeah, that, but they're real. <laughs> you know, but in all, in all, all, all kidding aside, I heard that was going to be another figure that was in a, in a plan. Yeah, it was going to be on the next you know, wave. They, yeah, but they just ended it. Yeah. Yeah, it was. Yeah, because you've, um, I've also, I'm also saying it that. Jabba the Hutt play set. It's got that um, that chain. For yeah. Well, so it's probably going to do a slave layer next wave as well. But we never got. Yeah, it. they never did. They never did. Well, we got Ula with Serlacious Crumb in that mail away. Yes. Yeah, that's yeah. that's who's the chained to mine. Girl. Is that that Ula dancing girl is the one that's chained to my Boba Fett in my display. Or job of the hot, not chained to Boba Fett. Why would I say that? She's chained to Boba Fett. That's weird. You never know. <laughs> That's the best clone mode. <laughs> right. Was it Legacy? Was it Legacy Collection? I don't remember if that's what they were. Was that what, at the time yeah. when this was coming out? Yeah. 2002, do you say? 2003, it is. Yeah. 2003. Uh, so. I've got me. It's the it's the art it's the articulated clone trooper because that same year they made those ones that didn't move. You know, there was one lying on the ground, there was one holding his gun. It was like a three pack. And they I don't think they're that they don't have that much articulation, if any at all. No, they look like they look like bootlegs, don't they? They're a bit dodgy looking, yeah, aren't they? I, I hated those. Yeah. 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 It was just yeah. supposed to be a thing for army building, but it's kind yeah. of like yeah, yeah, it's a neat idea. Yeah. It's a neat idea. You made a three pack, but why aren't they posable? <laughs> yeah, they had those weird ones with the gold stuff on them. That was like, well, they got gold on them. They were never in a film, weren't they? They made a load of weird clones and markings that you never, never saw yeah. in the film. Can't find two thousand and three. Well, the Saga collection, yeah. They had their ups and downs. Like they were, you know, they in the nineties they were buff and crazy, and then they went to like nice looking figures, you know, and like the first floppy hat Luke was pretty decent. And then they and there, there was a good I remember there was a good Jedi Luke during that time. And then they went back downhill, and then they went back up to like, you know. And all that yeah. stuff from when the Clone Wars was really popular, and they were yeah. doing all those like, animated, yeah, the animated, like five, yeah, 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 like like fives and uh, who was it? There was, five, there, was, there was Echo, like all those, and, and I, I was like, I kicked myself today because when I left Seattle, I sold the guy all my clones. I had Echo. I had I got Gree. I still kept Gree. I got Gree up there. But I had Echo, I had Fives, I had, you know, a number of those those named characters, the special ones. And uh, someone in Seattle, when I left, he was in the club, he offered a, a chunk for him. And I was like, yeah, sure, I could use the money for traveling, go ahead. You know, and Clone Wars was never my focus, so I was like, why not? And then uh, now it's kind of like, you know, I'm sort of more into it. Than I was, so I'm like now I kind of yeah. want fives. I, I would like to have fives. I'd like to have Echo, you know, and those that yeah. that that group of trainees that we watched growing through 
heavy and all them. And uh, and now they're like a hundred, hundred and fifty dollars each. I'm like, leave it <laughs> loose. And I'm like, are you kidding me? <laughs> they're more than vintage figures. Why? <laughs> yeah, some of the. I mean, yeah, is it? Someone was saying there. He does his Clone Tuesday. He did a Shadow Trooper the other day, which is quite cool. But you get some of those those weird clones, like the Utapa Trooper a clone that you never saw that they put in. Yeah. And he was like, he's the purple and there's a black with the yeah and yeah yeah some weird really weird troop clones they brought out that you never saw, weren't they? But they're supposed to be in the background, sort of stealthy. <laughs> you can still get some of them quite to reasonable price. So yeah. Yeah, Jimmy, you'll have to come on sometime. Gree and the Gree and the, maybe typing. <laughs> the Gree and the Shock Trooper is just a vintage collection, is ridiculous price, aren't they? So they need to yeah. be re released, aren't they? But the helm helmets are too big, aren't they? They're too they look too big, they look silly. So, are uh, they, do they look too big? Yeah, yeah, because they can come off so. I don't have a big. lot, I don't have a lot from that era, I think, in the vintage yeah. collection. The shock trigger is a lovely card. It's a lovely card. I got but some of the, I got some of the vintage collection when they first started, like maybe ten or so, and then oh, for some I... reason I stopped, and then I picked it back up when they were like in the hundreds. <laughs> so mm. it was like until now. So I got this whole chunk in the middle that I didn't get, you know. Yeah. But yeah, now they're re-releasing some of them. Yeah, like the Anakin and the. Do I be one? Yeah. yeah, from the Clone Wars, yeah, because they're a silly price. Or, they, so. or they're the ones that I bought and they, I opened them all up and they're in my collection because they're um they were really because they're so highly articulated and look so good that those are the ones that were I was opening and putting in my displays for comparison between the Kenner and the new modern, you mm. know. Yeah. Yeah, you got the best figure there, John. <laughs> that mold. <laughs> there you go. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. That's Jedi. That's JediBusiness dot com, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yeah. Yeah. They're, yeah. They, yeah. Yeah. That's Chris B. I think it is. Yeah. He's. Yeah. 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 Chris and podcast. Jake. They they were in my club. That's 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 how I know those guys. They were oh, in the Seattle club. Yeah. Yeah. Jake's on his. That's what now, I'm isn't saying. He? That's what I'm saying. Jake and Chris, who do these kind of things, had no concern yeah. over COO marks, but yet they do these. This is what they do, well, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like, I'm, why I'm weren't they that. talking about this? If they, you we know? had a fall, we had a falling out a couple of years back, so I'm not going to say much about them. <laughs> Chris and Jake are the only ones who talk to me from that club. That's what I. Well, besides Gus, but Gus isn't really kind of in the club, I guess. But. Yeah, yeah, because Jake occasionally talks on the sound, uh, sound crawler podcast, doesn't he? He does it with those guys occasionally, so they sort of separated, didn't they? I think, the, yeah, on the Jedi, maybe they did, podcast. you know, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, they were yeah. all that they were all on Galaxy of Toys, yeah, like that, yeah, yeah. They, don't, yeah. they don't do them very what often, I, though, do they? What, what happened is when I left Seattle and moved to Florida, Galaxy of Toys banned me and it blocked me from all their stuff. And I'm like, yeah, just because I moved, why? <laughs> like, what happened? I had Trade to move. move I, I had to move. It, I didn't have a choice. Oh, come on, like, come on, that's not fair. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a nice guy. Everybody likes me, but they just, I just say, I say what I mean, and some people don't like it. No. Retro blasting. Uh, <laughs> 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 okay, I mean, I say what I mean. That's I'm from Yorkshire. That's what we do. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll never bullshit anybody. I'll never say I'll be behind anybody's back. You know what I mean? Yeah. People don't like what. What I say, they, they just don't like me. So, <laughs> what can I do? Um, it's got I, I actually quite, I actually quite like, I actually quite like people who don't hold back. 
say what's on your mind. Let's discuss it and get it out in the open. <laughs> and then if I'm, and then, and then no, because seriously, because yeah. then, then if I'm doing something wrong, if I'm doing something that's offending you or pissing you off, the only way I'm going to know is if you're being blunt with me. Exactly. If you're blunt, yeah. and, if you're blunt and honest with me, and something I said offended you, and the only way I'm going to change, the only way I'm going to correct my behavior is if you tell me. So I'd rather have someone yeah. tell me than hide behind my back. You know, yeah. get pissed off at me and let me correct my whatever I'm doing wrong. You know, or what? <laughs> yeah, I know, you know? I know what you're talking about, Tim. I don't know. Help, yep. help me, help me grow as a person. Basically, you're you know, buying, you're buying too many toys, John. There you go. That's <laughs> <laughs> you're buying too many toys. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, I've, I've, I've come to an age where I don't care what anybody says anymore. So I, I have to say, <laughs> I have to say, it's collectibles to the wife. She says, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." Collectibles. All what you want. And and some, poor people, some poor people's wives say dollies, and that's the worst. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, the one, the one word I hate is figurines. Oh, it's dollies is worse. Yeah. Uh, Figure they're not uh, figurines. Figurines are ornaments. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I can see yeah. some of some of Matt's wife's friends are asking Matt's wife, does your husband still collect dollies? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's oh, side shape isn't it? Um, really? <laughs> Hot toy collectors, sorry. <laughs> they collect dollies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, being blunt, mate. Eh? <laughs> did you did you want one of these, John? Oh, yeah, I want a Star World because I've got um the space case, <laughs> but I don't have a Star World. Yeah, this is up at auction on Saturday. Yeah. So I'll uh... see. There's there's a, there's a million of them online that are going between twenty and thirty dollars. But I I just get a little weirded out. Twenty to thirty dollars for a for just an empty case seems like a bit much, you know. So I'm hoping yeah. to eventually find one ten, fifteen, maybe twenty if it's you know if I feel generous that day. But <laughs> yeah. well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bid on it anyway. And um, if you want it, if you want it, it's, it's up yeah. to you. I keep uh, looking at the action. There's an action force case. Well. It doesn't. It doesn't have the the innards though. There's no innard. There's no tray. No. no. Yeah. No. No. It's supposed to have one tray in there for twelve figures. Wow. Yeah. That's why it's cheap, I guess. But talking about legs anyway. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This. Um... That's nice. Yeah, there's a couple of nice ones. There's like a GI combat one. There's an action force or action action something case that I saw. Yeah, it's a cassette case, they call it. Yeah. And, case. Yeah, and then there's the mm. um there's a superhero one that's yellow that looks really interesting. Like I've been looking yeah. at a lot of these different strange cases. They're generic. They weren't designed for they you know, they're supposed to lean towards a specific toy line. But they're yeah. not made by that company. You know what I mean? No. Four hundred and twenty. I was thinking it's got the figures as well. Does it? Yeah. yeah. I'm after. I'm being after that. That stand for ages, but uh, I'm not paying for that. Not paying for the figures as well. I mean, the current bid's four hundred and twenty pound. Yeah. It's going to go for about a thousand pound, not. I would have thought. So yeah, I just it's it's coming up on Saturday, the twenty fifth, ten o'clock in the morning. So I might uh, I might live stream it. I'm live streaming the uh, the poster auction tomorrow at twelve o'clock. All right. Okay. So, um, so twelve o'clock noon, like your time. So that yeah. be too early. Seven. Seven. Too early. Seven. Yeah. Up. Yeah. I will just yeah, be yeah. waking up. I've been getting up between six and seven, so. See, 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 it's a toy auction. Yeah. But there's other things in it as well. Oh, talk by. Oh, that's the home. Home alone thing. Yeah. 
Yeah. I like Ghostbusters. That's pretty cool. Oh, backpack as well. Huh. Wow. That's pretty cool. I've seen those. James before. Bond, yeah. James Bond. Yeah. That's pretty cool. That's a good packaging. I like that. Yeah. <clears throat> £85 at the moment. You can you can obviously put bids in before it starts. There what you go. is that? What's Troy Logo? What's that I, one? I'm, dis <laughs> I'm disturbed. I'm disturbed by that one above the tri logo. Oh, uh, dancing down. <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> <laughs> well, mind. <laughs> uh, that space range is pretty cool. How much do they yeah. want for the dig? The old guy? Dignitary. There's so many of them with that giant <laughs> sticker on it. I see that so often. Yeah. Well, we'll they all see they all came from that one store. Everyone that's available in the market came from that one store. Well, was yeah. I mean, so yeah, it's okay. battered, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I was looking at the box that came with that um that switchblade from mask. The yeah. switchblade from mask, and it's like the box is completely destroyed. Like it won't even hold its own shape. <laughs> It'll it won't stand up. And I was trying to get it. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking of you know the one spot where the box is glued, and then if you undo that glue part, it would lay flat. You know, you would unfold it and it would lay flat. Yeah. I was actually thinking like of gluing a, a rigid board to it to flatten it out because it's all bent and warped, you know, and it won't flatten out on its own because it's so old and like worn out. Yeah. But. So I was like, maybe I could glue a board to it, a rigid thing, to make it flat out, and then fold it back up and re-glue it shut, you know? And I don't know. Because it's pretty, oh, the box really is pretty worthless as it is. It's oh, not. Look at that. Look up. Oh, it's a sticker. <laughs> yeah. It's a kind of box. With a Palatoy sticker. A oh, sticker on. I just wondered because it was saying, it was saying rare, and I thought, why is it rare? <clears throat> Were did they do that before they started printing their own boxes? Is that the deal, or oh, it must have been? Um, I've got a uh, that's, that's one of the boxes I've got, Palatoy box, but it's in really bad. It's not the best shape. Yeah, does it have uh, a sticker, or is it printed on there? No, it's it's printed as Palatoy. So. That's probably yeah. why this is rare because it's got the sticker on. Yeah, but yeah, somebody's. I've had this. Pulled it off. I've had yeah, this for ages. Shame, Real shame, Mark. Yeah, Tim. Um, yeah. this is uh, East Bristol Auctions. I like All having right. the boxes. It's a nice one, Mike, Mark, Matt. Huh? It's a nice one, Matt. It's a nice one, Matt. I like having the boxes. Yeah, it's, it's it's got tape. It's got a bit of tape damage on it. It's got no insert though. It's got the instructions with it. You know that job lot of weapons we were watching? Oh, yeah. Do you know how much it went for? Must be like 300 something. 163 pounds. 163. Yeah. Most of them are common weapons, weren't they? They weren't like. Yeah, I know. Really shocking. Oh, that's nice. So first release of Luke Saber. Is that a Luke? No, it's uh, oh. Hasbro signature. Oh, is it blue? Oh, it looks green for me. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, I don't have yeah. I don't have Obi Wan Blue. That's I wouldn't nice. mind having no. Obi Wan Blue. That's yeah. supposed to be one of the best it's ones fun. they've done, the brightest ones. Yeah. yeah. One of the best blues. Power Rangers. <laughs> Oh, they're nice. Starsky and Hutch and Professionals. <laughs> nice. Look at those. Oh, oh. you're showing your age. <laughs> Starsky and Hutch was cool. That's a cool car. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Professionals was the English version, really, would you say? Yeah. Hmm. Uh, yeah. They were like secret. More like, yeah, more like yeah, special agents. What, cops? No, I don't know. Yeah. 
yeah, special. Yeah, special. Secret, yeah, yeah. <laughs> whatever the. <laughs> yeah. <one. laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. Starting games. There's some interesting lots. Oh, that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, face. 120. Oh. Yeah, 120. Current bed. Go, Jack. I'll pay a hundred. I'll pay a hundred. That's my top for Yak face. I'll pay a hundred if anyone's I'll, got one out there. I think we'd all pay a hundred. <laughs> I think that's, that's the ratio green on it, isn't it? Yeah. Ah, oh, it's too not too mint. Boats. That's when they were bringing knobs off. <laughs> yeah. Diecast cars. If they put if, if they put all the Star Star Wars stuff together, oh an eighteen. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah. But it's all black. Why is it all black? It's got the red stripe. Yeah, but it's supposed to be grey on top. Uh, they wouldn't they save money by doing it one, two colours, wouldn't they? Yeah, true. So they would only spray one colour, two colours, is a Yep, selling job. The guy that in the shop. Oh, Black Series Tie Fighter. Jeez, oh, the giant one. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, wicket. Oh, nice. That's cheap. What's that? 93, is it? Or 83, I can't see. 80. Current bid's 80. All right, 80. Hmm. I think yeah. I'll pay 120 for it at most. Yeah. Oh. Rare signed photograph. I've got a signed photograph for Patrick Stewart. It's not that rare. <laughs> Ooh, 160 pound. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh, Hasbro Saga collection. Pedal Shuttle. That's the one I got. Yeah. That's the yeah. Oh. Saga one. Okay, nice. so 22 pounds so far. Ah, oh, the modern. That's why. Ah. No. Uh, vintage 1990s Kenner. Um, <laughs> no. That's what I was trying to say like before, a few days ago. I was oh, like, right. there you go. Well, John a lot Marshall. of these. A lot of these things are now the nineties people are listing as vintage and it's like ATT I want one of them. Yeah, me too. He's complete as well. I saw one of them in the shop, I just got rid of it. They're mass the one that I saw the one that I saw at one of my friends' house was massive and I'm like I'd need a whole new shelf to put that on. Rare. 2004. It is, it is the really new release. Even, that's rest though. Yeah, it's a it's a big one. And then they re-released it again in the Disney parks, haven't they? That's the yeah. that's the latest re-release. That is hard to. Well, the Disney park ones is hollow inside. It's just a big empty thing. Oh well, there's yeah. a star destroyer there. Let's have a look at those. Oh yeah. Oh, big, well, well, a big, big, messy pile of whatever. You'd need a lot of parts. <laughs> nice. You'd need to get a lot of parts for oh, these. Oh, look at how yellow that is. Oh, that is, that's a restoration project project for me, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, a load of parts. Yeah. Yeah, what's that one? JJ hmm. Abrams. Fine photograph, no thanks. <laughs> so this is this 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 auction is tomorrow or it's currently going on? Saturday. Saturday, okay. It yeah, ends, doesn't it? Saturday ends, yeah. yeah. So people bid in. Yeah. I mean why would you put in that in by itself? If it had the box and if it had it chain guns and everything were complete, yeah, but I don't know. Oh, Firefox, nice. Oh, there you go. It's in the wrong way, but never mind. I had one of those. I don't know where it is. Oh, oh advertising. That's quite nice. Huh. 
See, we had we had Lionel trains when we were growing up. All right. You didn't have home, but they were they were heavy. They were made out of solid iron or something. They were just yeah. like I remember barely being able to lift the the engine when I was a kid. I was always like lift it's like lifting weights. That thing was so heavy. <laughs> uh, we had home, but a scale electric. I think I had that scale electric four hundred. But it was it was a Lionel train that my dad had when he was like a twelve or thirteen years old. So it was like it had been in our family since he was a little kid. Demon's but then out. when he got older, he sold it in auction when he got older. So I was like, yeah. I don't have it now. I mean, now that I'm my age, I'm like, I would appreciate having it. I want it. Yeah. But at least he sold it at auction. <laughs> there's, there's Luke's white server. Yeah. yeah, I got right. Luke's. Oops. Episode one figures. 15 pounds. <laughs> wow, I got, it. I got I got that Luke. I got Luke. Oh, ah. Amigo Hulk. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Amigo, Amigo, yeah. Amigo. Nice night. I want the Rathacon, like, 12 or 13-inch Klingon, All which right. I think which I think Mego made, I think Mego made it. Um, but it's super rare. Like, I don't even see it on eBay for sale. Speed about that. Oh, yeah. I, I see the weird... I see the weird version for sale once in a while that has the painted. It looks like he has makeup on his face, but I don't see the version that I had when I was a kid. I don't see it hardly Ooh. ever. I saw a picture of it once in a magazine, like a, when someone was trying to sell it, but it was like thousand dollars. And I was like, no way. Uh, wow. 340 quid. Cool. That's the best bin one, right? Yeah. They're not. Yeah. The cloud, cloud city. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't that that came with a couple figures, didn't it? Yeah, you got f four, was it? Was it? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Lando, Han, Lobot, Lobot, and in an in an Ugnot. Ugnot, yeah. Ugnot, yeah. Ugnot. That Something like that, anyway. Was it looking? <laughs> Well, transport. Yep. There you go. That's the big one, isn't it? And that's rare, apparently. <laughs> See, I want an X-wing. Mm -mm. Oh, look at that. Grand Are they difficult? Figure. Like it looks like there's a lot of X-wings here, but are they are they kind of yeah. difficult? I mean, why? Well, a Palatoy oh. one for a... Ooh. American podcast. Mm -hmm. Is that best dungeon? Oh, it's the first version. Yeah, um... Ooh, look at that. Star Destroyer. Collector Fleet, Star Destroyer. That's nice. I have one... I have one that's, like... The box is like three or four feet long, and it has lights and sound. Yeah. I've had it forever. I've had it since I gotta say, like probably okay. eighty eight or eighty nine. It's like I've had it forever. It's still in the box. I never got around to putting it together. Yeah. Star Destroyer. Pretty rocket. I had that. Yeah, with the X Wing, I don't. I don't want to pay a lot of money. I'm not bothered if it's Kenner or if it's uh, Palatai. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just gotta wait till you find the right price. Yeah. There you are. You want player set? A lot, of, lot of player sets. Oh, Dragons not many are. figures, do I? So, Vader's saber. Yeah, Ooh, action man. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I got Luke's lightsaber. I got Luke Jedi lightsaber. I got Yoda's lightsaber. Darth Vader, Kylo Ren, and then my lightsaber that I built at, at Galaxy's Edge. Wow. But I wouldn't mind I wouldn't mind an Obi Wan blue. Okay. That would round out the collection quite yeah. nice. 
Oh, and then oh. getting Leia's from Rise of Skywalker. Leia's from Rise of Skywalker. Oh, be that's cool good. To have. oh yeah. yeah, that's getting yeah. released, isn't it? Are they re-releasing? Uh... Go ahead. I think they're re. Is it Ventresses? They're re-releasing them, aren't they? Vent Ventresses, oh, yeah. Sabers, and yeah, that, yeah, Dooku's. I think eventually going to re-release them. Canadian version of the best been player that came with the counted fat. Nice. Oh. I want to get a Darth Vader oh, TIE fighter. That's, <laughs> I, that's the one thing. That's the one ship and that's the one ship oh, in place that like Kenner Kenner stuff that I want to get is a is a Darth Vader TIE fighter. Yeah. That, oh, it's still in bugs. That's nice. And a do back. I kind of want a do back too. Kind yeah, of. that looks those, like those are, ones. those are two things I should hunt, maybe start hunt, trying to hunt down. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> oh, that's the one I have. Yeah, hundred and ten. I'll uh, see. Yeah, uh, two hundred, two hundred pound. That's is that what they expect or? Yeah, it's the estimates hundred to two hundred. Yeah, it just, it just depends how prices are going. I, I, that's just why I, I might watch it and see how, pr how the prices are going because the last auction are just horrific. That's nice. That Corgi toys illuminated double sided sign. Wow! Oh, wow. wow. Huh. Nice. <laughs> Ooh, that's nice. Yeah, as you said, it's lots of different. Yeah, we go out going for a few hours, that one it, that auction. <clears throat> Looks yeah. like it'll have to, yeah. Yeah. Uh, 240 lots, so. Oh, my God. That's all day, yeah, isn't it? The, um, I think that one that I watched last that's time right. had, had 250 lots in it. TIE Fighter, A-Wing, and what? Oh, that's a... Snow Speeder, yeah. Is it a snow yeah. speeder? Okay, yep. Because those were counter molds, right? Weren't they counter molds? Yeah. Oh, turbo tank. Oh, there's the yeah. turbo tank. Yeah. Hey. How much is that? Oh, 55. 55. That's tempting. Now, those are, those are also mass. Yeah, those are massive also. Oh, like, like yeah. You need, a, you need a whole new shelf just to put that on. Yeah. Not seen one of those before. Yeah, you occasionally see them on eBay, but they, they go for over 100. So, and they're always, and they're always missing bits. bits. They're missing all the rockets and guns. Yeah. And yeah. yeah. And there should be a speeder bike inside of it as well. So, Is that what had the little white speeder bike? Yeah. Is that speeder bike. Yeah. 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 White yep, speeder. Yep. Working lights. I can't see the speeder bike, but it has got it on it in it somewhere. Apparently. Yep. I see. I sometimes see the white speeder bike, and I'm like, "Where did that come from?" Yeah, mm. it didn't come with the Atta as well. Like a newer uh, version of the Atta. Came with the yeah. one, didn't it? It came with the uh, leg legacy one, didn't it? Mm. They had a couple okay. in there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. You could put a speeder bike in the Republic gunship as well. They made it so you could drop one in the back. You didn't it didn't come with it, oh, but you is, could fit it. Is that what those two little grooves are for? I wondered what that yeah. was for. So I've got yeah. that gunship and I look at that. <laughs> three twenty. Three twenty, is that what it says? Yeah. Oh look at that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, look at that. oh dear. Wow. That's wow, that's great, isn't in, it? Is it still in the package? Is it still in the bag? Yeah. yeah. In the bag, it looks like it's. Is that the bag all marked or is that cracked like that? It looks like yeah. it's a bag. It's yeah. mint. It's absolutely mint. Yeah. I don't think they've had it out. No, not yeah. hardly. They built it. They, yeah, they it looks look like hand. No, they look like hand pictures to me. They're not. Well, I don't know that one. That one, of course, looks like the thing. You're right. No, that's just the. No, that that's in the bag. That's not. 
Yeah, that's the plastic, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Wow. DTM, hey, how you doing? So that's how the gunner's supposed to look, huh? Or that's yeah. just all the bits in a pile. Okay. Yeah. That's just all the bits in a pile. That's actually, actually gunner there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So the box, the box had already been opened and torn apart. See, so that yeah, then that's because that box is a little rough on the edges there. Oh yeah, they always are. Yeah. Did you see the the picture from Vectis? With um, the, the, the the there was a shipper case, and they had a three or four <laughs> mint boxed versions in it. Wow. Hmm. Yeah, I was talking about it with the guy on the comments in my channel that um he was saying something. I don't know if it was Jabba the Hutt's place that or something, but like ye like twenty years ago they ran across that. Like someone was at a store hmm. and they found them like shoved behind the 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 rack or something where they had all the old back stock and they pulled them out and he was there and he happened to be he was like, So I was able to buy them all fresh from the case. And they sold them to him for like six dollars each or something. And then, you know, ten or fifteen years later, he was selling them for a hundred dollars. <laughs> you know, like <laughs> so he's like, yeah, I, I made out, you know, because they were fresh from the case. Like I think it was Jabba the Hutt's, uh, you know, stand there with Jabba and stuff. And I was like, you don't see that these days anymore. You got to find like a mom and pop shop that had been open in the eighties that has never cleaned out their back room in order to find oh yeah something like that. something like you know like an empty a, a case that's never been touched you know yeah yeah, yeah. You, you, you can't walk into a walmart or a target and find that you know like that's no. never gonna happen that's why i want no, to go yeah. in the old woolworths go in there uh in their lofts see what's what's in their boxes imagine that yeah. oh. dtm's gonna buy a uh attack this weekend what the auction at that auction Oh, I just have you just found one that's on a randomly on eBay. Um, I'm assuming Helen's your uh, better half, but mm. with the chin guns and everything, right? Yeah, like mine there. <laughs> hey, Mark, I meant to ask how hey, how are your chin are your chin guns like turning slightly yellow or are they still clear yeah. white? They've got to be. They've got to be yellow. If the white, if the if the clear, the repro, the repro. No, not yeah, necessarily. Yeah, yeah. mostly. No, there's, yeah. there's mostly. people I know. There's people I know. Who, yeah. There's Speak people really I know who kept theirs on. in the. There's people I know who've kept theirs in the box from the moment they bought oh, it. Oh, yeah. right? if you if you kept them in the box and they haven't come out of the box, yeah, they're still going to be yeah. clear. Yeah, ninety nine percent of the time, they go yellow. So yeah. Singles have got to be yellow. Yeah, because mine, oh, mine have mine have slightly yellowed over the years, yeah. so I just wondered if yeah. yours were the same. You got to look for the you got to look for the join as well. There's a little join in the yeah. the mold on the I ends. Know, I mine out, but uh, that could that not too bad. Mine actually. Oh, I'll just bring the bloody thing over. No, well, because it's it's all the figures. I'm going then. Ugh. It's not gonna fall down. Have you had it on the floor? That's what I do. <laughs> so they're not, they're not so bad, actually. Yeah, I think mine are more yellow than yours. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the, the point. Quite yellow. Mine are. Um, mine are look, so. yeah. 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 Yeah, I think mine look more like Matt's. Yeah. Yeah. Are we still wearing? I think the batteries are not in. Oh, well, I don't. I don't leave the batteries in, man. Uh, no way. I'll take mine out. I think mine yeah, out. mine too. They're setting off to the side. I got a pile, so if I want to put the batteries well, in they're, anything, they're, I've got some in here, but they're popped, so I'll just put them back. I think mine. Are. You know, I had I had something. I can't remember which toy it is now, but. I had something where I left the batteries in there, and they came back for it a couple of years later, and they were corroded and just garbed, like like they had exploded, and there was just junk everywhere. So after that happened, I was like, no more leaving batteries and stuff. Yeah, I I I did that with the um with the uh, the Royal and the Boost Starship, you know, the boxed one. Oh yeah. That one. 
I got it sealed and I unsealed it because the batteries are fitted inside this ship and they're known for they're known for rotting and destroying. And I actually took it all out out of the bags and uh, and they were got they were going, they were starting to corrode. So I picked wow, them all out, wow. bagged it all back up and it's was boxed up in the loft. So yeah. uh, yeah, I got this I got it and saved it just before because I've seen some people pull them out and they are, the thing is destroyed even for a modern ship. A lot of people wow. hate that. Everyone hates that. A lot of people hate it. They're all in their old ship. But I think it's a, it, it was something that size back then. Oh, it's yeah. massive. Yeah, it's I massive. sold. I actually, I actually sold mine to a guy in the UK. He bought. All right. Really? He bought that ship. He bought that ship. He bought. I had an ad in the box from that era. Um, he bought that. He bought like all the biggest things I had. And I remember he asked me to try and see if I could get them all in one box. And the post wouldn't send it because it was such a big box. Yeah. So I had to break it up. I had to send each thing individually. And he paid for all the posts and everything. Wow. And he paid a couple hundred dollars for each item. It was like, it was crazy. I was dealing with him for months. It was like, yeah. Yeah. Get to, get to well, yeah <laughs> But of all yeah. of all the stuff I sold, I got to say, of all the stuff I sold to him, the only thing I kind of wish I still had was that Royal Starship, just yeah. because it was one of the largest Star Wars things ever made. I mean, it was yeah. it was absolutely massive. It was uh, unbelievably yeah. huge. It yeah. is, yeah. Yeah, yeah I've got mine but in the box. But I didn't mine know. Still... It, yeah. was, it was still in the box. It was still in the box, and it would have still been in the box today because I did not know about the battery thing. So mine yeah. would have been ruined by now. <laughs> yeah, the two AAA batteries in the in the bottom of the engine compartment bit underneath, and they yep. just uh, they don't. I've seen pictures of people that have pulled them out. That's the problem, isn't it? You're like, well, it's sealed. I want to sell it sealed, yeah. but there it's gradually killing the the ship. So do you take yeah. the risk? And I just cut it open and took them out. I'd rather keep the so. I mean, it's never going to be an it's never going to be a really expensive thing but they go for over a hundred now i think boxed because you've got the red droid oh you've yeah red, yeah if you've got the red droid i've got it complete so yeah yeah i was very careful put it back in its bag sealed it back up put it straight back in so see if i had still had it i would have after this is done i would have shut everything down <laughs> gone over and found it opened it up and found it battery corrosion and ruined <laughs> yeah yeah you think well, so well the batteries have been in there what over tw twenty years or something, aren't yeah. they? No more. Yeah. So. Yeah. 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 Twenty one, really, wasn't it? And they must have fitted them in the when they started making them in in late two thousand eight, not yes, to make them to sell them. Yeah. Yeah. So. Have you got yeah. the well, the, the box for the attack? If I got a box, no, 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 yeah. no. Yeah. I've got I've got the, no. the Shikes back box, and it's the best box I've ever seen. For an empire, for an attack, you know, you, yeah. you know, the attack boxes are like they're just because because of the the fold in, the flaps fold yeah, in. Yeah, they go the like that. that. Got. The box yeah. is probably worth more than the bloody attack because it's it's that it's it probably is. Yeah. It is mint. It's palatite it's mint. It's Empire Strikes Back. It's perfect. Yeah, I've got that stored away. <laughs> yeah, I'd love to get a box for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, my my. I'm weird like that <laughs> boxes. Yeah, my friend Gary's a bit weird. He has well, some it's not probably not weird. He has one boxed and one loose. So he has a boxed one, and then he has a loose the loose version next to it and does that in his room. So everything's boxed and the loose one. It's quite a good idea. But it's a lot yeah. of it takes a lot of room. You're buying two of everything, one without a box. So but yeah. you can say this is what it looks like out of the out of the box. So yeah. it's quite a good idea. Well, you could always put the empty box behind them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'd like to. I'd like to find a box for this as well. So and stick that in a box. So uh, yeah, because yeah. it's not the best, oh, yeah. it's not the best looking thing. But they're, put it in a box. It look nice on the shelf. Huh? They're quite. They're quite easy to find. Yeah, I've been looking. Uh, so. Yeah. Yeah, I want a nice box of one. I just have the uh, I got the instructions and the sticker sheet for the ad at because when I I guess when I got it and I opened it I just we threw away the box but we kept I kept the innards all the inside stuff you know yeah 
There you go. Oh. But that's what that's what got me back oh. into collecting was the <laughs> uh, you know? Ready to Oh, this Excellent. <laughs> Got rid of it. I just hated yeah. it. So, and bloody nerf gun in it. Oh. <laughs> you control the action. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, just like Doug Vader. Doug Vader. <laughs> <laughs> Doug Vader. <laughs> uh, DCM. I I like I I like the vintage collection stuff. I really like the. Uh, Poe's X-Wing, X-Wing is amazing, I think. Yeah, was, are you waiting for that, are you still? Yeah. But I got Poe's X-Wing, but Luke's is in the mail. I'm waiting for it, yeah. Yeah, I think I'd get Poe out of the two because the wings are not very good on Luke, are they? The wing mechanism. Yeah, you got to... I mean, if you haven't seen it yet, if you haven't seen it yet, you got to watch the video I do on Poe when I... I'm open, I open the whole box of Poe's X-Wing and I'm putting it together live on the video. And I put the right. wings on upside down. I oh, know. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm sitting there, and I, after it's built, and I'm going, boy, they don't line up right, do they? And I'm like, no. oh, that's because I put them on upside down, duh. I'm going, everyone in the comments is like, you idiot, you know, like they're. Because <laughs> <laughs> uh. everybody who's watching it, they catch it before I do. Everyone who watches the video catches that I'm putting it up together backwards <laughs> before I catch it in the actual video. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost as bad as the uh, Obi Wan arm Kenobi when I'm when I review the figure. I open I open him up and I'm doing all the articulation. And his arm breaks off. I'm like, oh boy. <laughs> uh, yeah. How many how many X wings have you seen with the wings are the wrong way on well, the wrong way round? It should be the flat edge at the front and the curved. How many times have you seen the curved at the front? I've seen so many people sell them on eBay and they're the wrong way round. You know. <laughs> the silly, the modern, the modern X wing because you could take the wings off, and now they're, you know, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't like that low cake swing. You're right. Yeah, it's, you got it. Gotta... Comes, comes down in price. I will get that. Yeah, yeah. I just, yeah. Uh, I think the wings till... are too, wings are too floppy. So yeah, it took, yeah. Till, it took till just now for me to order it. You know that I finally, I finally ordered it. That, so um, it's, it's in the mail. So an it. Is it next but, week? Um, Slave one comes out. Really already? Yeah, yeah. Start I wasn't shipping. able. I would have ordered it when I got that twelve hundred dollar. Oh, well, it wasn't. It was, I didn't think it was still, until um, like at the summer. But oh, uh, right. it should start shipping next week. It's, That's what it's I've heard. One hundred and fifty. One hundred and fifty pound though. Was, what the hell? It said it was, well, it was full up. That. I couldn't order it. Yeah. Now I've got my got my little one up there. I'm happy. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm happy. Like I was saying, you can get a, you can get a proper vintage slave one for a lot cheaper than you buying a a brand new modern vintage collection slave yeah. one. Yeah. Too big, isn't it? <laughs> I didn't, yeah, I didn't think about that, but you're probably right. Yeah. Doesn't make I've sense, actually never it? looked. I've never looked for a vintage slave one. I've never bothered. So, right. uh, I bought one in a shop a couple of months back for 120 pound. Huh. Boxed mm. Palatai boxed one, and Strikes back boxed one. So yeah, it's yeah. not a ship that I really like. So I, I, did, I sold it. Yeah, I, I like the side of the Shadow of the Empires one, which is I love. So. When they put when we repainted it, it looks so much better. 
Apparently that slave one is ninety-five pound on Amazon. Yeah. So that's not too bad. Yeah. That's what that's my point. Um the black series snow speeder was ninety pound, ninety two pound, whatever. Mm. So why is yeah. why is his collection more expensive? Mm. If I had the space to put it, I'd like to get a shuttle Tidarium again to, from yeah, uh, the event. I want to that. Because I, I had one that was just a shell. It had the canopy in the side door, but it was missing all the guns and all the stuff, all the bits from inside, like everything was missing. And I so I sold it because it, it was one of those things where it was like I was looking at it and going, it's cheaper to buy a new one that has all the stuff with it, like a complete one. Than it is for me to go buy all the bits that I need for this one. So when someone offered me something for it, I just took it. I was like, yeah, here, take it. Because I was like, I'm not gonna go find, it. but I kind of, I kind of should go back and get that, you know, because I've always wanted one. Yeah, DTM's uh, pre-ordered the slave one. Well, I was going to pre-order the slave one, but went for blacks. I'd rather have that snow speeder, I think. That looks yeah, yeah pre-order. I was still able. I was still able to get a pre-order for the speeder, but when I went to do the slave one, we because we got our checks for that that government thing, the twelve hundred dollars. But the slave one was full. It was full up. I couldn't pre-order. I couldn't order it anymore. So no. I went for the. I went for the snow speeder. Yeah, I was like, well, I'll get that then. Because that's probably going to be cooler, anyways, right? Oh yeah. Oh, oh. Definitely. I mean, uh, the only thing we're getting that snow speed is you're going to have to buy a look and open it up. So, oh, yeah. yeah. I think yeah. if you just put that in the front, I, one's going to really avoid that word. So. I don't know. Did I pre-order? I think I just pre-ordered one Luke. I don't, I don't know if I got one or yeah. two coming. I'll probably Me. just... Uh, I won't bother. I don't I'll know. bother with it yet. I'll see if it, it still... I think it's still pre-order on certain places. Yeah, I'm going to wait till the price goes down on it. Yeah, it might drop. Yeah. It might not. Yeah. I think it's one just... of those ones that won't drop because a lot of something's dropped. Black series and big, you know, the yeah. Jewback holding its price. That's still that's never dropped, is it? The Jewback. It's too popular. No. Uh, no. MP's S speeder. That's never really dropped. Uh, really. The, the, huh. What we were saying earlier about um, Gentle Giant not selling, well, Black Series sells. So yeah. saying I bet, they don't, I bet they? the Ray. I bet the Ray with speeder is real cheap, right? Who, does anybody want yeah. that one? Yeah, yeah, you get it like yeah. twenty quid. Yeah, twenty pound. I mean that, yeah. that Land Speeder went for twenty five pound on Amazon. Yeah, at one point. So. I've got. Yeah, because I at one point they were cheap and I bought two. So I got one Ray with speeder open and one Ray with speeder sealed. And then I got one Luke Land speeder open, one Luke Land speeder sealed. I've got two Dubacks open and one Dubac sealed. And I got one Emphy's Nest open and two Emphy's Nest sealed. Because at mm. some point I found them all real cheap. So I just bought yeah. the whole load. <laughs> You're always trying his stuff. You're keeping us going. Yeah. Well, our Target stores and stuff do that. They just mark them down one day willy nilly, or they do one of those things where they're like, if you buy a hundred dollars worth of stuff, we'll give you a fifty dollar gift card. So I count that as on sale. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. yeah. they give you half the money back to spend later. So I count that as on sale. We get nothing like that. No, no. we never get discounts like that in this country. Nope. <sighs> Shocking. Yeah. Now I think um I think we've uh, gone over as uh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. Right. but the thing is we've got more viewers than we normally get at the moment. <laughs> it's... I gotta go back and fix the finish the car. We're we're working on my dad's car. He hit the all right. There's these plastic there's these plastic shields that went under his car and somehow all the rivets fell out, so the plastic's hanging down. And so we 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 went to like five different stores this morning before we found the right rivets that go back up in there. But no, annoyed the hell out of me because we're driving all over the world, and I'm like, uh, we're not even supposed to be out. Why do you need this now? You know, like <laughs> mm. we finally got them. So I got it now. I'm going to go put them on and fix the car. You know. Right. So thanks for watching, everybody. Um, 
please subscribe to me. Not none of these two, just me. <laughs> I'm it's funny, I, I lost a subscriber last night, but I've got one back, so I'm still oh, on my two from yesterday. Yeah, so it's slowing, slowing again, down a bit, so I need to I need to start. Yeah, I, yeah. People. Yeah, I need to yeah. share it out. Yeah. Uh, awesome gig show. Yeah. Does that say 1.4? One point four. I was at 1.13 day. Yeah, I look at hey, you're growing. Popular. You're yeah. growing. You can, uh, yeah, yeah. It's that retro collection you found, isn't it? Yeah, that's probably yeah. what. It is. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mask oh, my, so, over on Universal. Well, there's there's, oh, there's more retro collection. I saw on my feed more retro collection videos showed up, so I. I know there's a lot more. Now they're starting to show up in videos. See you, DTM. Cheers, DTM. See you tomorrow. I'm back at 8 o'clock. Yeah. So uh, don't be late. <laughs> <laughs> 3 o'clock Eastern if you're in the States. <laughs> yeah, as well. It's funny how in, they're still saying it's uh, Greenwich Mean Time. Especially on Facebook. Mm. Facebook saying we're mm. coming out at 7 o'clock and we're not. It's 8 o'clock. Yeah. But then, that's my new video. The unboxing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, I was going to do a different video today, but ended up not doing it. So I will do it. No, because I'm doing my mm. live stream tomorrow, but I'll, I'll probably do a video as well. All right. I, fin yeah, I well. finally did the Rhino, and I like that ejector seat on the Rhino. Yeah, <laughs> nice that. Nice that. Right, thanks for watching, everybody. Yeah. Bye, bye We'll see you all tomorrow at 8 o'clock. See you later. See ya.